busy, busy morning. It's the Opie and Anthony Show. I don't know how we're going to get everyone's plugs in, but we're going to try. We got Patrice O'Neill. Thank you. This means you out there in Radio Land, you got to pay close attention. So we're going to give, uh, I think, three, maybe four plugs right now. Patrice O'Neill is going to be at Governor's Comedy Club out there on Long Island today and tomorrow. Yes. In Levittown, right? It's a great club. I haven't been there in a while, yes. but uh, Governor's I've never, is, I've never been there. Governor's is a great club. They do a good job out there. It's going to be a nightmare getting out to Long Island, so you better leave now. Yeah, I'm, I'm probably going to take your advice. you got to leave real early, Patrice, or, or the 8 o'clock show is going to be disappointing because you're not going to be on that stage. And you're talking leaving at 5 to get to a 9 o'clock show is leaving late. 5? Leave <clears> at, <throat> Jimmy said it, 2 or 3. Oh, this way you can go, you're relaxed in the hotel. Yeah. You have no choice. You're, not, you're under the weather. All right. It's rush hour all the time going out to Long Island. Then you got uh, Bob Kelly uh, sitting next to Patrice uh, stuffing his fat face. And he's going to be at uh, Caroline's here in New York City. What did say? <laughs> Bob has cheese you. connecting his... It looks like the beginning of a great porno scene. <laughs> <laughs> what an ending. <laughs> what the ending. What the ending. <laughs> sure. 212-757-4100 is Caroline's. Well, you, you there just one Friday, show tonight? Friday, Saturday, 1030, Sunday, 8 o'clock. And okay. we're all looking forward to the Comedy Central special that you, you taped a while ago. They're finally showing that. January 18th, right? And, January 18th, and once yeah. again, I was at the tape at that taping, and uh, Bobby was great. Absolutely <laughs> great. Really? Did you? He was great. No now, jokes. You, Standing did, ovation, did everything. Did you see my Dev Jam set that's going to air Sunday? No, but I've been obsessed. I told Patrice this. That hat, walking out like he's Big E, just a man. Just got I can't tell you how badly I wanted to use some sort of weapon to remove that hat. A pickaxe. What a great way to get that hat off. I was trying to upgrade my... Uh, my uh... My appearance. Sure. I think it looks good on you. Does, I think you, you actually pull it off. It yeah. you know, not it many people good. can. It annoys me that he's recreated himself as actually kind of a suave player, and it works. And it annoys me. You know me. why? Because you're a big guy, and the the hat and the leather and stuff. It's very intimidating. Even though I know you're, you know, a pussy. Well, but. <laughs> I tell people that. <laughs> nice guy. Also, you've been animated by Coke Logic. It's, oh yeah, it's cold out here or whatever. That that bit you did with yeah, with the rest area where the guy's it. knocking on no the window, looking for some me? action, and you're just in the rest <laughs> yeah, area. Where, my check? You're in the rest area. <laughs> Tell me these things. I'm, you know, getting a few. I just got a publicist. I need my yeah. publicist needs to know these things. Well, the animation's doing very well on iTunes. We got to deal with iTunes right now. Really? You go to iTunes. Can you tell? We're me? not getting money either. And, and I didn't ask for right, money. Right. I just I just want somebody to know me. It's it, <laughs> well, it's just good promotion for the show. Uh, yeah. Some of these animations have made it to iTunes. You go to the podcast section. It's called O and A Shorts. You download them for free. Really? We're not asking for nothing. And they What's animated. What's say, Patrice O'Neill? Uh, yeah, and it looks like you're there. Look right there. That's how you look. There's animated. a creepy guy at the wow. window. <laughs> wow! How cool is that? And he just does it to the story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, is, he uses the audio from the you know, show. You know the ones they showed a traveling virus. It's kind of like that vibe. You just play the radio show. Wow. Show. Yeah, and you just go to iTunes. They're they're throwing one up a week, I think. Uh, an animation <laughs> up a Why week that you can you download for free. What? Just page me. Or say something. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. I love myself in cartoon That's form cool. for some reason. Yeah, isn't that good oh when my you're a cartoon? God, you know? And uh, you pull in, and then the creepy guy comes up to your window. Yeah. When oh, you're uh, oh my gosh! How cool is that? There <laughs> you <laughs> are, animated, that? sleeping. Oh! You wake up because someone's knocking on your window, and he's just standing there. Oh my gosh! That's what happened. <laughs> That's him. <laughs> That's the creepy guy. Is Coke Logic the dude? <laughs> Why does a creepy guy look like Norton? <laughs> Norton with it's his like hair growing in a little bit. Yeah, George like Bush a little bit. Yeah, young George Bush. Holy! Yeah, we're very <laughs> we're very proud of these animations. And that now is amazing. I'm glad whoever I don't Hope know. Logic. I'm so really happy great. he did that, man. Great. Uh, Logan got this deal done. Really? Yeah, it's great. Great promotion for the show. This is the way you do it, right here. You get iTunes involved. O and A shorts podcast section. That internet. Uh, the next big thing I hear. By the way, uh, be one, huge. one of the top downloads on iTunes every week is these animations. <laughs> People are eating them up. So there you go, Patrice. Thanks for telling me. <laughs> <laughs> Ten days into 2008. How long? <laughs> Started recently. It's a recent. Yeah. Wow, man. And uh, we got Louis C.K. joining the program as well. A very, very uh, busy studio today. Any, any gigs you're doing, Lou? Uh, I'm in Miami on Wednesday, but Ooh. nobody cares. What? Why, why, <laughs> why Wednesday? Wednesday. Why? It's part of the festival. They're having a, the South Beach Comedy Festival. 
And then after that, uh, this weekend I'm in uh, Knoxville, Tennessee, and uh, Louisville, Kentucky. Louisville for Louis C.K. Yeah, Look yeah, at that, my huh? first time uh, playing Louisville. Natural. Cool. Um, Bob, that'd be like you working in Douchetown. <laughs> <laughs> you working in Tranny Town. <laughs> oh, oh. No, but he's not a tranny. You didn't, get, you didn't get how that would work. <laughs> Thanks, for, 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 a, for a free, free trial? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Stick up for him, Lou. No, I mean, he has trial? sex with tranny. Hold on, everyone's talking at the same time. I just wanted to know about this cartoon. I'm enamored with this cartoon. Yeah. Nobody cares for about a free person. fourteen day. Don't t look it. <laughs> Can you not take a little glory? I seen you with a big cartoon too, Mister. I Sneaky. think it's great, but we talked about it for a long time. <laughs> I don't now. care. Wait a minute, Louis. Oh, just hold on. Important. See, I just it's some about pushy Hispanics. Um, you know what? <laughs> pushy Hispanics, Louis C.K. This it says for. You a need, four but you're a guy that needs to be cut off sometimes. Cause you're all the time, but I just otherwise need it would all be you. You're you're like you're not even you're you can't be a minority because any room with you you're so big and loud and talk a lot. Why don't you just say Lynch so I can ask for your fire? Just say it. Just say it. So that you. All right, listen. If I wanna, you're in a room, you're a majority. You're never a minority. I want to. I want to play some we uh, we got in yesterday. The racial effect. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> We're gonna we're gonna like direct this ship and then we're gonna go. Uh, All right, then, then we'll get crazy here. Uh, we got some audio yesterday. Clemens admitting that he did the steroids. Are you kidding? Now this has to be exclusive because I really yeah. haven't heard this anywhere. Yeah, for some reason ESPN's not playing this yet. Yeah, I, I don't I know why. I wonder why. It's shocking. The fan here in New York, they're they're avoiding this, but we got it. Mm -hmm. Exclusive audio. Clemens admitting the steroids. Really? Yeah. Check this out. I want to say thanks to this Mitchell report. Um, I've been getting emails and questions on this subject, and uh, now the whole world knows. The answer is that I use steroids. Over the last 15 days or so, <laughs> when I played in Toronto for the Blue Jays, Brian Mack made use steroids to inject into my body. And I'm very thankful for those steroids. And <laughs> this has been extremely difficult uh, to do this. I'm almost numb to steroids and human growth hormones. I'm, I'm angry about it, to be honest with you. Um, it's hurtful to have thousands of people to inject human growth hormones into my body. My friends to inject steroids into my body. The New York Yankees to inject human growth hormones into my body. Uh, my children use drugs and it means a lot to me. And my family to inject steroids. Uh, again, uh, it's amazing to me that um, I have to even use steroids. And uh, I want to say thanks to Brian McNamee of the New York Yankees. Uh, after Christmas, I'm going to sit down with Mike Wallace of 60 Minutes, and I'll inject drugs into my body <laughs> right there in front of him, and we'll do all this again. And let me be clear that I'm very thankful for those steroids. And Mike Wallace used drugs now that that's come out. Uh, my children to inject steroids into Mike Wallace of 60 Minutes. <laughs> coming upon Christmas now, and I, and I have been blessed in my life. I've been blessed in my career, and the answer is that I use steroids. There you go. <laughs> oh, is that funny? Boy, they really spun that. <laughs> yeah, that's not how yeah. I. That is really wild. I don't know how it got to where his children you know, are injecting just... Mike Wallace with drugs. Boy, this, the, but the <clears throat> filter—that's what he said. But then, by the time he gets filtered to you on ESPN, yeah, yeah, it's completely to different. Totally murky. <laughs> it's totally murky. At least yeah. we had the uncut version. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> Uh, somebody had you a little too much time on their hands. <laughs> um, Love that. Do I believe? Nah. No. No? He did something. Just can't prove it. Yeah. It's just weird that that guy did it to Andy Pettit, who's like really, by you know, really Christian and stuff. I don't know. If you, like he's done ads for books about God yep. on TV. Yeah. So he just told the truth. He said, yeah, I'm ashamed yeah. and I'm sorry. So, did it like uh, once and yeah, and was he's to recover quickly. And this guy Brian McNamee was introduced uh, uh, like Clemens introduced him to Pettit and told Pettit, "You got to use this guy." Yeah. And so what? This guy said to Pettit, "Listen, Roger doesn't do this steroid stuff, but you should. <laughs> you should <laughs> this one time." <laughs> and I, I mean, I can't get Roger to do him. It's weird. Yeah, he just won't do him. <laughs> yeah, he won't. <laughs> but you should do him. And Pettit was like, "Yeah, I mean, what? Sure, why not? <laughs> yeah, I'll try." Yeah. That accusing somebody of something is the thing that bothers me. But the 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 thing that I would think that gets me is to, in terms of believing that he might did it. Is, is the argument of you don't get better when you get 40. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Physically. Yeah, yeah. That's what all the Hall of Fame, that's what Goose yeah. Gossage said. Come on. You're yes. that old and you got better? Yeah, he it's got one better. Thing, like, Nolan Ryan was probably the last non-steroid older baseball guy, and he just managed to sputter into his 40s a little bit. Yeah. Threw a no-hitter and then got out. Yeah. 
But Clemens, when he when Clemens threw a piece of bat at Piazza, I was like, yeah, that guy's on drugs. <laughs> <laughs> he's, like, like, yeah. he's got mental problems from things that shouldn't be inside of him. Uh, yeah. it, but he's doing uh, he's doing the right thing as far as putting doubt in people's minds. All you have oh, yeah. to do with a situation like this, there's no proving it. No. There's no actual videotape. There's not. We we love proof. We love yep. catching people red hand in these uh, these days. Yep. And there's none of that. So all he has to do is say, look, I didn't do it. And I'm going to sit down here. I'm going to tell you how I didn't do it. I'm going to do interviews saying I didn't do it. Yeah. And then people will go, you know, maybe he didn't. The power of denial it, is unbelievable. Yeah. When I was a kid, I got, Love I got caught. I stole uh, triple beam balances from my science <laughs> class. Oh, and yeah. I sold them to drug dealers for a pot. <laughs> I was in eighth grade. I was like 12 years old. All right. <laughs> and, uh, I stole like. 20 of them because I got somehow I figured out how to get into the science. Uh, uh, anyway, I got caught and they just knew I did it. And I just kept saying, No, I didn't. Nope. I kept saying, I didn't. I don't even know what you're talking. No, I don't even do drugs. I don't smoke pot. I just kept saying it and the and I just wore them down. You ever watch? And I didn't. They, they finally said, Well, we can't really. Why is that not working for, yeah, for Barry Bonds? That's true, though. though. If you just what? deny it. Why is yep. Barry Bonds getting ready to go to court? For lying about something that all, you're saying that no one can prove it. All he's got to do is keep denying. Keep denying. Yeah. No, but it's different because he's black. <laughs> oh, that must well, be I didn't want to say that. <laughs> yeah, well, you're, let's be honest. Of course, that's why. Yeah, I mean, let's, I, of course, let's, let's, black. Let's, let's just when black little. people deny anything, it's the opposite for black people. Oh, right. I forgot to for tell you. For black people, it's the opposite. When they deny something, you go, oh, geez, Juice has been denying it for Look at them lie. Jesus, what a liar. <laughs> no, it's exactly. Rocky All Clemens white people, we have to premise this whole thing. All white people have to do. Right, is, is deny. deny. Is deny. And eventually people go, oh, come on, give them the benefit of the doubt. Black people have to confess or else it's just going to get hot <laughs> on you. Black, black, <laughs> if you watch any of those crime shows, we have to, we have, and they have to change the entire system. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But even if you didn't do it, you have system. to confess. Yeah. Even if you uh, didn't do it, you should just say you, you know, did yeah, so yeah, it. I, I love those shows. I love the crime right. shows on A&E where they show the confessions. Right. And they bring people in. And a lot of times, the people that just stick to the denial, right. it goes into the cold case files. And maybe they get them 20 years later. Yeah. But th it's the people that are sitting there. And it's like, come on now. Look, we got this, this, this. Yeah. And they never really have anything. Right. But it goes... All right. Uh, yeah. Okay. I was in the car when he was <laughs> shot. I was, in, and then before you know it, the guy's like, "I shot the man. I yeah, killed him. Exactly. I, I good problem solved. Crime solved. Just deny it." Yeah, but the more exactly. you say, to, you have to just say no, no. When they yeah, ask I know, you, but it is true. no, no. Because the more you talk, they're gonna get you. It's yeah, like the yeah. cops. I got a. Uh, I was with this uh, lady one time that you pay to give you back rubs in LA. <laughs> yeah, okay. And uh, the, as soon as we were done, I actually just put my sneaker on. Knock, knock, knock. Cops right at the door, and they came in and they they had me. They took me on the curb. They just started going. Come on, man. What was going on there? Were you just get? Were you just getting a back? They need. The only reason they're asking is because they need you to say yes. yes I yeah, was but they doing kept that. asking they me like. You know, on you I just right kept there. going. Nope. Nope. No, 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 no. But they would get me to like buddy, buddy, like, ah, well, I mean, one, I mean, we were, and I was like, no, no. no. And they finally were like, look, he's not saying anything. We just, and they let me go. They were pissed too. But that really is, were. that really is the difference between life for whites and blacks. <laughs> if you're white and you kill somebody on television, <laughs> as long as you just keep denying it, you're going to get out of it. Yeah. If you're black and you were at home sleeping and someone 4,000 miles away got killed, and they ask you if you did it, you better just say you did it. <laughs> just <laughs> confess. You're, they're going to get you know, They're going to hang it on you. Unless Monk is around. I was That's driving right. through a questionable be area one time you. where there were prostitutes. And uh, let's just say I had glasses many, many years ago. Let's just say there was a transsexual who walked over and <laughs> snatched my glasses. And then I was sitting there. Why did she want your glasses? What's that? Why did she want your glasses? Thank you for at least sheing it up. And, <laughs> and, it on. and I was it's sitting there. It's out of respect there. for her. I'm let's respecting was, her choice. Uh, I was sitting there. And let's just say I couldn't drive because I couldn't see. And I saw a police car. <laughs> Oh God! And I saw a police car. And I had to high beam the police car and say, "He took my glasses." And the policeman had to walk over and go, "Did you take his glasses?" Oh my God! And, and this person had to go, "Yes." And the policeman had to say, "Give the glasses back." Oh my God! Because the policeman said, "What are you doing around here?" I said, "I just I'm lost." And, you uh, lost because a tranny remember. stole your glasses. Uh, stole them right off my face, <laughs> right off, right through the window. Why did she steal them? them? I have no idea. She was mad at I you was, for why something. Did, why did he steal them? Let's just no, yeah, no, come on. Let's I mean, stop this. Let's stop humoring uh, him. Yeah. Why? why did that man? 
with breasts <laughs> Why did that glasses. fella? Why did that gentleman? I, I don't know. I actually don't know. They're, they're crazy. They carry razors soaked in, in garlic. They, 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 <laughs> I don't know. Garlic. It's not emotionally healthy people. Why garlic? They have the genitals of both sexes. Was there a dis- <laughs> was Why there a garlic? Because garlic? Norton looks like Nosferatu. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they have their genitals duct taped to was, their Was paint. there a conversation going on? No. Yes, it was. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Opie. Just stop. Why the window do you was down. The there was something Can we have on. an intervention no, about no. this little Listen homosexual? No, no, no. I'll tell you. I was at a stop sign. It was in the meatpacking district. There was there was a bunch of a trannies. Stop sign. And at the meat, the in the meatpacking district. Yes. Okay. Fair um, enough. Of course, I was riding around looking at whores, but I wasn't talking to this one. I didn't see it coming. Oh, so <laughs> just an arbitrary hooker that happened to be a dude just came and took your little glass. That's off your what face. I'm trying to tell you. Right. And <laughs> snatched so a, a guy. Wa- a girl walked up that looked a like Daryl Stra- Strawberry, <laughs> and you just started talking no, to her. Nobody would talk. I'm to gonna tell you what happened. Norton had one of those little uh, those little tirades that he has if Kenny's around. But he forgot Kenny wasn't there, <clears throat> and a big there. transvestite stole your glasses. First of all, transvestite is different, and you don't, no one likes they, to be, You don't want to be lumped in with Haitians. They don't want to be lumped in with. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> a little respect. Oh. A little respect. Oh, for you. damn it, Norton! <laughs> Transsexual. <laughs> but no, that's difference? long before I ever heard of Kenny. That's that's before I think before I even did comedy. Was, was, he cursed out. He cursed. The, he cursed the training out for something. Yeah, something went. On. My glasses got he taken doesn't want, off. He no, doesn't want to share. It. So just, why would they he just, just reach into in your and window take and your glasses. glasses? Yeah, because I wouldn't. I'll tell you what it was. Be, I, there you go. I wasn't buying. It was you know, a very aggressive, aggr- would, aggressive salesman. It was yes. Who it was, was leaning and going? Come on, I, I swear this would be a good experience. It was somebody for you. that goes. You're, and you're going. Looking, no, thank you. Because you were looking for something prettier. I was. Yeah. I was no, I was not <laughs> yeah. going to pick up. You understand how my addiction works. You I were trying to actually get up. some meat. You were trying to get some steaks at the meatpacking district. <laughs> yes, I was riding around looking for. This is a huge misunderstanding. <laughs> no, I because uh, I wasn't picking up, and that's what it was about. It was just she got she got annoyed and snapped. It was like that fast, and I had no communication with this person whatsoever. No. And uh, I had to tell the police. Uh, she took my glasses. Uh, and the police had <laughs> that to get is them. hilarious. And they said, "Get back the glasses." Uh, there you go, Coke Logic. Oh. There's your next animation. Yeah, please. <laughs> I, just, I just visualized that one. Love to see one. that one. Oh, hey, we got to take. Oh, quick... Magoo! Yeah. You've done it again. You couldn't see. Do you know what it's like? <laughs> To sit in your car in a sea of men in dresses and, uh, and not be able to drive away. Sir. I can't go anywhere. I got bad eyesight, folks. Sir. Uh, to LASIK. A blurry thing stole my glasses. Yeah. So you, you to... I'll ask this nice young lady if she could help me. Oh. A, a confused, self hating blur took my glasses. You just had to sit there until you got your glasses. That was that's that's horrendous. Oh, hey, quick wow. break. We got a break <laughs> and when we get back we'll get into the dr phil thing because we got a lot of people in studio that do the xbox and uh you know it's being used to yell and scream racist stuff and uh no. dr phil is tackling this very, yes very important issue as we go to break uh our homeless friend tippy tom most of you guys know tippy tom he came in and uh and we had him do a little uh books on tape for everybody so check this out as we uh as we go to break the Opie and Anthony Institute of Art and Literature is proud to present a collection of books on tape, soulfully voiced by the homeless, Tippy Tom. I can't do as good as that guy to do it, but you know. Masterpieces like Herman Melville's Moby Dick. Call me a small. Some years ago. Never mind how long precisely. And Dickens' historically themed A Tale of Two Cities. It was the best of times. It was the worst of times. It was the age of wisdom. <laughs> I'm doing a good job. Okay. You won't believe your ears as Tom mutters and fumbles his way through Mark Twain's classic, Huck Finn. Huck Finn's wealth and the fact that he was under the, the window Douglas's protection. <laughs> okay, I guess I'm getting it right. And then be prepared to have your breath taken away, literally, with his read of Great Expectations. Heaven knows we'd never be ashamed of our tears. Okay, of course not. Anyway, I think I got sort of it right. And finally, you'll enjoy the classic for all ages, Dr. Seuss's Green Eggs and Ham. Great eggs? And ham. No, green eggs and hams. Yeah, go ahead and see what my glasses are. I am Sam. I am Sam. Sam, I am. 
Come on, man, I got my damn glasses on. Who even knew Tippy Tom had glasses? <laughs> no, 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 no. It's a collection of some of the finest literature ever written and then read by a homeless drunk. Order Tippy Tom Books on Tape today. Hey, good morning. It's uh, the Opie and Anthony Show. Let me set the scene here. It's a very, very, very busy morning. We got Patrice O'Neill on the couch. We got Bob Kelly on the couch. We got Louis C.K. to my right. We got Basil T's in the corner uh, making omelets for everybody. And we got English Gavin, who's 6'5", 290 pounds, not a hint of fat on his body. He's got the binoculars, and he's checking out uh, the girl exercising naked. And he's uncut. <laughs> he's uncut. Bob Kelly needs to add to that. I'm taking a sauna with him. <laughs> hey, uh, Gavin, how's it going out there? How's it going out the window this morning? Yeah, we that mic's on, uh, not on. Why would it be? Why would it be? Why would that microphone be on? It needs to be that one? Okay. Why would Gavin, it? what are you seeing out the window? I'm, I'm seeing nothing right now. She's still wearing clothes, and unfortunately, she's trying to read a magazine and whatnot, but uh, she's really teasing me. Yeah, she, uh, <laughs> she does <laughs> get naked. I want to climb over that fence and just... Uh, <laughs> She's any, what about the mag? Are there naked chicks in the magazine? Oh, actually, you might. Yeah, she actually has. Yeah. Uh, Gavin, we've seen her naked many, many times. Wow. You're not missing oh, much. Is she a white girl? Oh, really? Well, yeah. yeah. yeah she's Gavin got a, loves white girl. He's going to do I'll the, do the, the blade girls. jump right over to that. Yeah, it does. He actually. He white. I like white girls. He did a girl over my apartment. My my girlfriend's best friend. He came over. Romance her in like uh, four hours, and then that night just blasted her on my couch. <laughs> the girl fell in love with him. This this white girl from Boston fell in love with this black Englishman, yeah, and he oh dumped God. her. And he's such a Viking. He's just probably a Viking. Oh, she was a me, she me and Don destroyed were, your couch. Me and, and all kind of, me and Don, we were yeah. holding each other in the bed, like oh my God, like there was a monster attacking her. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> he, as well. he drank awful. out of his helmet and left. It was a bad day. <laughs> I drank out of her skull. <laughs> 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 he what just is, blasted her. You, you were scared for your life, what you were hearing? We were just holding each other like, she's going to be okay, honey. She's like, go out there and help her. I'm not going out there. It's Gavin. He's uncut. <laughs> He'll grab me with that thing and throw me like an elephant. It's, it's prehensile. It's, it's, it's big English jam. He looks like a pug's face. <laughs> friends <laughs> that, was a, that was a compliment yes and then we got to get back to jimmy too the instant feedback everybody's pointing I completely out forgot especially steven s from bayshore you got to give josh uh from ohio some credit as well and kevin from connecticut also saying the same thing that uh, the trini the tranny in that situation you described me yeah i completely yeah. forgot i've told mm -hmm. the story and I, when it had been happening i've been riding around in this circle and and the train did say for wasting my time because i wouldn't stop that's why uh, she took his glasses why. Uh, and feet. and my shoes. So I completely forgot about that. Oh, it was awful. <laughs> Officer, I need my glasses back. The the gentleman dressed like a woman took them from me, and I can't see, goddammit. <laughs> <laughs> you must have been pathetic. No, no, that makes you feel really good. Uh, I tried to drive away, but I hit something with a penis. <laughs> 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 well, you know, every good gentleman has a fault. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and just when you thought the back. show couldn't get any crazier, we got Howie Mandel standing by. He's on the phone here. Howie. Yes. How are you, buddy? Uh, have you reached the guest quota yet? Well, yeah, I know. Really. I, I think this is <laughs> the. I think this is the most mics we've had on in a very long time. That work. Uh, but we wanted to squeeze you in there, Howie. Thanks. It's uh, it's an honor to be part of this extravaganza. Yeah, it is an extravaganza. We got uh, we got a girl ready to be naked and exercising across the way. We Does got... she know she's going to be on the radio? Uh, <laughs> she will. What, you know what, Howie? <laughs> this girl knows that people are looking at her because she has no shades, no blinds. Every yeah, morning, it keeps it open. Every morning, it's the same routine. She takes all her clothes off. She jumps on an exercise bike. Uh, which isn't doing any 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 uh, help whatsoever. She got a big ass, yeah. and uh, she's not really into Wait, shaving. She, she's, she's naked on an exercise bike every morning, every morning well, without it's, fail. It's not about the exercise if she's sitting on one of those seats peddling. <laughs> <laughs> you said there's a seat. <laughs> yeah, there's no seat. It's not about losing weight. It's no, just smelling up the seat. And then and then she <laughs> then she goes and she showers. She comes back out naked, hangs out for a while, uh, a little more naked. Yeah. And, uh, you know, no Goes blinds. Yeah, every single light in her apartment is on. She's not hi trying to hide you know anything. What, you know she what? does have blinds. It's just that she, they, they're pointed so that if you look, like, you don't think about, when you have blinds, you don't think about the people that are above you. 
looking down through the slats. But you gotta, yeah, yeah. Like, you sort you of... got to alert her. It would be great to alert her live on the air, which she, next time she's naked on the bike, you go, send somebody down to buzz the apartment. <laughs> well, we got to yeah, figure yeah. out which apartment it is you know, somehow. No Obi, I, I think that um, Balloon Glove Howie could have talked about this more in depth. But deal or no deal, how we can't do it. No, how <laughs> deal or no deal, how no, this no, is dangerous territory for deal or no deal, how we. I got to. I, I can do this. I'm in town doing live. Uh, you know, uh, Saturday and Sunday, I'm at Westbury Music Fair, and I'm at the Bergen County Theater in uh, Inglewood, New Jersey. I'm filthy on on. Uh, it's not the deal or no deal. I'm gonna, I'm, hold deal on, I'm gonna, gonna, I'm gonna no, I'm gonna back up Howie. He's been on our show ever uh, since the deal or no deal has become huge, and he's he's told us some horrific things. Really? Tonight, tonight yes. he's on. Right tonight he's actually on Monk. His uh, his uh, Monk episode airs tonight. Right, oh. but that's not filthy. That's me ridding Tony Shalhoub of his uh, his need to wipe his hands. That's who they yeah. hired me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey Howie, you wouldn't want to be in the studio. By the way, I'm I'm getting over the flu. Patrice has it. Uh, Jimmy's been sneezing all week. Anthony's had a couple sneezes going on uh, nah. the last few days. Bob just Kelly's dust. ugly. Bob Kelly's ugly. <laughs> but, I, but, I have, but I just bought a bidet. Yeah, but oh, Bob Kelly, Bob Kelly uh, told us about his bidet, and we were bragging about yours yesterday, Howie. No, I have. I told you about that toilet, right? Yeah, of course. Not you only did. a bidet, you don't touch anything. No, you don't touch toilet paper anymore. No, no. Have you ever had a cold? Wow. Yes, I get I get sicker more than any I get. So more. what's your point? Wait a minute, how do you use a bidet like to wipe like oh, everything? Like no, 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 no. This has this has. A, Does it have like acid in it? Like what if you have like a really sticky poo? No, this power wash. Power like, really? You just power blast wash. it? You set, it on, you set it on power wash and then and then and then blow dry. Those foam strips like a wow. car wash come out and just yeah. oh, funch, like funch, <laughs> funch. <laughs> lather it up and wax it. I don't know if I told you last time I accidentally hit the button that said front wash. And it was like one of those speed bags. <laughs> it's a thousand dollars that that toilet seat. Uh, way more than that. No, it's not the seat. I got the whole. I got the Neo Rest six hundred. It's like five grand. I got all the. I go. I walk into the into the bathroom at night. I don't even have to touch the light. The 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 seat automatically raises, and there's a beautiful glow. The a light. Comes you know out. who you are, Howie. You the old man <laughs> from the original Creep Show. What? Remember the, the roach guy? The, yeah. The, the, all the roaches? They creep up on you. Yeah, they creep up on you. It's just Bugs. Like, I don't Bugs. touch nothing. You got to touch something, Howie. No, I touch nothing. I go through life touching nothing. And then not only not only that, as soon as you sit down, it's like a warm, It's a, it's a, the seat is heated to a I have that. You have that. I have that. Yeah, well, Bob, Kelly, it, Bob Kelly's no, got the well, cheap version. Yeah, but he knows well, how he has. First of all, he's got deal or no deal money. I got Caroline's yeah. three show money. Bob but Kelly's you know seat what? you have to heat with matches. Just what I <laughs> save on toilet paper alone. It's it's worth. It. I don't even use toilet paper thousand dollars. So it's like the bidet from France, like the, the, the Japan. What they, I think. What the it's man, different saying, reasons though. How uh, Bob Bob, a, Bob I, wants comfortable craps because, like me, every time he t takes a dump, it's an emergency because <laughs> we both have bad diets and things come violently rocketing out of our asses. <laughs> <laughs> and so no. we need at least to be comfortable <laughs> during the trauma. We give yeah, birth you know every time we poop. Yeah. I how he it. how he is crazy and has mental problems no, and he can't I touch this. I made it a whole. I made it a whole it's kind of for me it's like a hobby now it's right. like i mean i took the i got a flat screen tv i put in I right in front that. of it i got and that I put a phone and ted ted bundy's hobby was I killing nurses <laughs> <laughs> how much does it cost to Ali, install that the, the what the, the uh the toilet yeah like the install you know the whole plumber thing no, honestly i think i was exaggerating i think the whole thing is like three grand totally installed yeah Poor Howie. Every time he comes on our show, he has to talk about his germs and his, and his uh, toilet. Please don't that's all we talk to him about. The toilet is fascinating. That that, that, Howie. That's my life. Yeah. Howie, do you find yourself sitting on the toilet longer and longer every day? Like Absolutely. I, like, I, I was like, it, 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 I'm getting addicted to the feeling of it cleaning me. My life revolves around crapping but since I got this toilet. That's that's my schedule, and then I fit everything around it. Hey, can I tell a Howie related story? By the way, yeah, Howie, this is Louis C.K. Remember? Uh, How, I remember he, you, Louis. You know I'm me, a huge pal? fan. Well, Howie, uh, and I, he took me to open for him in a few gigs, and we were in Poughkeepsie at the <laughs> Howling, whatever it is there. Yeah, yeah. Wolf. Yeah. yeah, so uh, we they gave us the mo the Motel Eight or whatever right. as a dressing room, and I went. How he didn't, you know, he just ate dinner and stayed, and then we just we left. But I went to the dressing room to, and the Motel Eight people had created this this presidential suite for Howie. Like they must have gone out and gotten special <laughs> furniture, and there was a gift basket. 
and there was a note saying uh, the owner of the hotel loves Howie more than anything and would love a picture with him. And we did this room just for you. And I re- look at this stuff, and I didn't. I just was like, screw him, and I didn't tell Howie. <laughs> you never told, <laughs> never told him. <laughs> never told him. Like I just, I was in a bad mood. I was bitter for some reason. Oh, Probably because so I was cool. opening for Howie Mandel at the Howling Wolf in Poughkeepsie. <laughs> <laughs> but, the Laughing Wolf. Yeah, and I just didn't tell well, you anybody. Weren't bitter, you weren't bitter enough to trash the room <laughs> no, exactly. and write back, fuck you. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Oh, excuse me. That's, That's all right. right. Oops. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, oops. Ah, well. Hey, are, you any, are, are you any better with uh, Howie? On, I, I don't know. What, am I talking on? Is this, uh, no, this is regular radio. Are you any better with the germs now, or is it the same thing? Why, like, within three months, how did I get cured? No. Well, no, but any better. Is there any <laughs> no. progress at all? No. No. <laughs> no. What, what, what did you hear I was doing that would enhance the progress? Yeah. Nothing. I just figured that we've talked about it. Now we're talking about it again, so maybe you had Would you be more bit. uncomfortable if a black man or a white man licked your face? <laughs> <laughs> Let, let's just get let's just get down to the nitty gritty. Black man, there'll be a home invasion happening. <laughs> yeah, well, no, but Howie, do you go? Do you get counseling for it or anything? Or is this yeah, something I'm you... constantly. My okay. my therapist lives in a beautiful gated community. <laughs> yeah, it's a uh, yes. I'm I'm in cognitive therapy now. And you're right. married, right? Cognitive. Yes. You've got kids, right? So here's the question. Three kids. I have. I sit. I will sit. Some therapy sessions are just sitting there, shaking hands. <laughs> so you're you're married, Howie. Now here's the question. Um, raw diggy, you know, raw. Raw. What? I mean, I'm saying. Do you, you wear? Know? Co- do you wear a condom? Yeah, with your right. Wife? You go raw. No, yeah, I don't shake her hand. Yes, I go raw. Yeah. All right, I'm just checking. That yeah. doesn't that doesn't bug you? No, no, that. Do you do it like uh like I, uh, like a hot seed through a sheet or something? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Are you like a surgeon when you have sex? And then on Halloween, my kids go out as one-eyed ghosts. <laughs> <laughs> one, <laughs> one bloody-eyed ghost. <laughs> <laughs> one, pu- pussy bloody eye. <laughs> All right. Because the one-eyed cyclop ghost has pink eye. Yeah, oh eyes. man! Uh, wow. Oh. Trying to get most of this on the radio. Oh, by the way, so funny. Come on. <laughs> it's really it's so indirect. It takes oh, you so many, man. so much work to get to the <laughs> yeah to get there. there. Hey, how we yeah. still uh, still love and deal and no deal. And like I said, every time you come on our show, it's because of you. You, I mean, it's such a dumb concept. But I watch. All, I watch oh, every I, time I go. I I can't not watch it. I, I have know, to watch it's, it. It's I watch because of Howie. Because somehow he just makes it work. I don't get it. We're just, in the middle of a million dollar mission now. We're we're gonna and and hopefully somebody's gonna walk out of there with a million. That's that's the mission. Is every time that? every time somebody doesn't win the million, we're adding another case with a million, and wow. we're gonna do it up to fifty seven cases. Jesus. Wow. Howie, that show made me cry once. Why? Huh? It really did make me cry. Teary eyes? Yes. Well, well, it was a Marine. Somebody win? It was a, <laughs> like a Marine who came over from, he just came back from the war, and he had like two days here right. in New York, and he couldn't, they mentioned he couldn't see his family. There wasn't time to go to California to see them. So he's in his moment where he's going to see his his kids come out and right. his wife. He, he didn't know they weren't coming. Oh, yeah. So everybody's crying. And then that moment that he hits that every idiot on that show hits, <laughs> where you've got... <laughs> or it's time to walk away. You've got 150... It's always like at 125,000. Yeah, right. That basically, if you're, not, if you're in your living room, you're like, you, there's $125,000 in front of you, and you're saying, no, you piece, you just garbage human <laughs> well, being. But at that but point... So he hit that point, and he said to his kids, like, everyone was screaming, hey, you know, no deal! And he said to his little girls, he said, you see what's happening here? One hundred twenty-five thousand dollars, and there's a, like whatever. There's a one in four chance that mm. the odds are really good that I'll get more, and I'm not gonna I'm not gonna uh, gamble with your futures that way. And he took he said, uh, no deal. I just started balling. Uh, <laughs> <really? laughs> no, the thing that's great about that show though is that everyone screens no deal. Everyone wants yeah. it, but then the second the person takes the deal, hard, thank, yeah. thank you, thank you, thank, thank God, thank God. <laughs> We're all crazy. Thank God you're not crazy. Can I? Can I want to see a disaster. One that bothered me <laughs> it, 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 along the same lines was there was a we had a woman on whose husband was in Iraq, and and we went live to Fallujah. Oh. The guy's in the battlefield, and we're, I mean, we're looking at him with uh, night vision goggles. Wow. And, you know, he's, he's just a young kid. He's out there. He's in the worst part of w- wherever the, the, the war was going on. And they, she had gotten to a point where there wasn't much left on the board. I don't remember. And the offer was six figures, which would have changed the life. And, he said, and she goes, honey, what should I do? And from Fallujah, with a, you know, we have a horrible signal. 
he says, take the money, honey, just take the money. And then the satellite went out. We lost, we, oh we lost the guy. Oh. And she goes, and she goes, you know what? He doesn't know. <laughs> no deal. <laughs> Oh. Went home with a buck. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, oh, he must. See, what a bitch! What yeah. I do? He must have beat her savagely. <laughs> oh, when I, when he came <laughs> when I do at home, when it gets to the the you know the figure Louis was talking about, mm -hmm. 100, 125,000, mm -hmm. and they don't take that money. Right. You want them to take that money, and as soon yeah. as they say no deal, now you go the other way, and you're like, yeah. man, I hope he gets a dollar. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I gotta watch now and watch him lose right. it all. Right. Well, the oh, marine totally. that took the money, the marine that took now, the money. Do you what remember was the that next case? Do you remember that show, Howie, that Marine? I don't remember the uh, Marine. Was so Why, what, Louis, what was after mad. that? Do you remember? I don't what? remember, oh. but it was a great... I don't remember that part of it where then they break his heart that he could have had more. Look at Anthony. <laughs> yeah. Look at Anthony yeah, yeah. like, this sissy talk. No, I, I watched the show. I'm, I'm betting until I lose. I, well, He's like all this betting. No, I probably would be all totally all different on those game shows. Right. Howie, yeah. do you, Howie, do you uh. remember? Do you remember the Chinese guy who had come here with seventy five dollars? I love that. No, that's seven hundred and fifty dollars. Yeah, he that's... came here with seven hundred and fifty dollars. Yeah, and, the Korean guy. And he was like immigrant, and so now this is his family playing the show. And well, the, he the... said he said he said that uh, you know his family came from Korea with a one bag with seven hundred fifty dollars mm -hmm. in it mm -hmm. and two kids. So chase the American dream, and these two Korean, this couple put their kids through school and college, and now the kid was uh, just getting married, and he's on a game show. He says, I made it. It all started from $750, and I made it. And he starts playing the game, and then as luck would have it, all that's left on the board is $750,000, yep. $75,000, and seven hundred and fifty dollars. It's just weird. And, and then and then and then the offer comes in. The offer is like three hundred and something thousand dollars, and he says deal. He takes the deal. But it was amazing that they had. He started with seven fifty. His father seven fifty seventy five thousand and seven hundred fifty thousand. The numbers look great. I said let's see if you had made a good deal. Uh, if you made a good deal, had you said no deal to the three hundred and fifty, what would your next choice be? As he opens the next case. Seven hundred and fifty thousand dollars is revealed. So he uh, he got out at, at the perfect time. Yep. And then we open up his case to see what he had sold. He sold his case for three hundred fifty thousand dollars. We open his case, and his case that he started the game with was a case holding seven hundred and fifty dollars. Yeah, the same amount. Just of like he came day. over. But no, there was a moment of heroin. But there was a moment in that show when <laughs> they had kimchi. revealed all that, where the old man was crying. Like, yeah, the old that's man what I'm saying. The old man breaks in the crying. He's sitting down there. The old man breaks crying. I take the case with the seven hundred and fifty dollars, and I walk it down in the audience, and I put it back in his lap. That's right. But here's the thing. And Everyone, say the he was crying. Thing I think I've ever saw. I which said, was that, what? ladies and gentlemen, is the circle. Of life. Uh, I saw, yeah, but here's the thing. Uh, I had a totally. I saw a woman I had, on uh, Price I, is Right break her back doing Plinko. I, <laughs> and I, I had, cried. I had a totally different view of that show, though, because yeah. that guy was crying. He didn't say a word the whole time because he doesn't speak English. Right. He's crying at the end, and everyone's up standing and applauding. And I thought, and it was supposed to be because how great this is, but I thought the guy was crying because look what materialistic <laughs> douchebags my family have turned into. <laughs> yeah, he's all learned, upset. My whole struggle, my, yes, uh, he was like, my whole life struggle was a waste because these people have no values and they just chase uh, money. I on a game therapy. show when I came Louis, here. Louis, Louis, do I you care here. about any black people, any black stories on there? That's, What's that? You know, some kid from Compton who <laughs> lost his Air Force One. No, I any, don't any, care. Any black cry co any stories? Black no. Oh, no. stole all the cases and ran off <laughs> That's what... <laughs> <laughs> hey, how the kid, black kid stole that card with the money on it, thinking it was worth something. <laughs> like he stole the case. Chinese he actually, immigrants, he I cried for what? Spend what? That money. Hey, Howie, the other thing I like, and, and you guys don't do it all the time, but uh, you show the case going into commercial, so okay. the people at so the people at home know exactly what's in the case before the guy makes his decision. You like that? I didn't like that as much. I, I kind of like that. Oh. Okay. Yeah. I'll 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 give them the note. It doesn't matter, I guess. Yeah. Opie and, liked this. But what I I guess what I like about the show, you're always throwing a, a different twist into it. And we th are. And the I theme shows and all that. It's, it's does the bank the banker doesn't he just say hey uh, how he suck my blank or yeah. something? Doesn't he just say <laughs> yeah? Because yeah, right? Or, yes. Yeah, it's all set up uh, way in advance. So, no, no, yeah. no, 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 no. He's really he really I'll has the offers. It. It's on a, It's a, he. But he, it doesn't take him that long to just save the money. He just says hey how uh, he. He either tries to throw me or he says. Uh, right. Horribly disgusting stuff about <laughs> right. the contestant, and, and I <laughs> tell that great. fat, tell that fat, smelly pig <laughs> <laughs> that I'll give her fifty thousand dollars for a case with you're not maggots in it. Yeah, yeah, not too far off. Yeah, because it gets boring <laughs> for you guys. Oh, keep it funny. Funny. I don't know if you watched the other day, but he actually, it was some woman had as a lucky charm her little girl's piggy bank. 
Mm-hmm. And he took it, and I thought he was going to take it. He actually smashed it. Oh, my God. He, <laughs> he did. He and I it? thought he was faking it. He actually smashed this little girl's piggy bank, and this woman's game just went down the toilet. I mean, he is <laughs> oh, <laughs> evil. That's, that's great. That's yeah. Scary. All right, Howie. So what do we got? Uh, you're going to be on Regis. You're hosting today, right? Yeah, I'm there now, so i got to go run. Oh. And I'm, I'm hosting, and I'll be at the uh, Bergen uh, Theater on uh, Sunday and on Saturday at Westbury Music Fair. Where the hell's Regis that he couldn't be there? I, I have no idea. It's very angry. I'll, I'll find out. I'll find out. Hey, good to talk to you guys again. Louie, great to talk to you. Yeah, Howie, take it easy. Okay. All, All right. right. Howie Mandela, everyone. Bye. Got to take a quick break. We're going to get into the Dr. Phil thing with the Xbox being oh, I want to hear this. Yeah, we got to squeeze that in before we get out of here. But first, it's the FU line. Thanks for calling the Opie and Anthony FU line. Here's the latest batch of FUs. You have six new voice messages. First voice message. Yeah, I'd like to leave a big you to driving in the left-hand lane on 93 southbound. We think it's cool to drive at 40 miles an hour while I'm trying to get to work and I'm already late. you. Next message. I want to put a big you to my boss who decided not to give anybody in the company Christmas bonuses to fly his ass to California for vacation. I hope your plane crashes and you die on the way back. F you. Next message. Hey, I'd like to leave a you to the Department of Personnel in New Jersey for up the fire department lieutenant promotional exam you dlc you next message i'm going to give a big f you to whoever got in this accident that i have to sit in right now you i hope you died next message i'd like to give a big f you to my boss for tracing in late every day and then getting on my ass for wasting time you next message i'd like to give a big you to Iowa. I'm sick about hearing about your caucuses. Just my end of new messages. Call the Opie and Anthony FU line. 866-FU line 1. That's 866-FU line 1. Thank you and goodbye. Right back into it. Opie and Anthony. Jimmy arguing with Tom down the hall. Patrice O'Neill. Oh, yeah. All playing, is the argument. Playing governors on Long Island all weekend. We got Bob Kelly playing Caroline's all weekend here in New York City. Uh, we got Louis C.K. Uh, where are you going to be again, Louis? Well, you know what? Uh, Febu- uh, what is it? February 14th. What's that holiday? Uh, St. Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day. I'm in, Day. Down, this is a big Opie Anthony weekend for me. St. Valentine's Day, I'm in uh, Buffalo. And nice. then the next night, I'm in Cleveland. Then the nice. next night, Michigan, uh, Detroit. Oh, there you go. So uh, that's all you guys' stuff. I'll be back, obviously, to plug those. But they're uh, all going on sale, like, today. They took us off the air in Detroit. They did? Not on satellite on okay. all the terrestrial, so they're still being heard in Detroit. Oh, actually, yeah. the satellite audience in the uh, Detroit area, huge. Well, we, I, do it has five. to be because I, saw, I almost, I mean, we went five. on the air, and we're almost sold out. I mean, we went on sale. And, I'm, and I know that's all O&A people. Yeah, no, there's no way that anybody in Detroit a, cares about me except for Florida. Lucky Louie? Yeah, but it's just Detroit. Like, I went on sale a bunch of <laughs> markets, and Detroit just went through the roof immediately. Oh. And I think it has to be from you guys. It's, it's a huge satellite market. Yeah. We noticed that this past summer, so... Uh, you got anything accomplished down the hall there, Jimmy? No, I mean, there was a couple of the dumps. I know why they did them, and, and there was one particular that, that bugged me. So I talked to Tom, and I, he was in the room when it was dumped, and he told him to dump it. I still don't 100% agree with it, but I okay. do understand. When he went through the progression of why he felt it should be dumped, it's like, all right, I mean, we're not going to win every battle and that one. I can kind of go, all right, I understand his thinking at least. I think Tom's uh, hanging, in the, <coughs> hanging in the dump room today, yeah, knowing that everybody's in today. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Tom, be, Tom's I'd a smart guy He's, when it comes to that. Yeah, he went progressively the... through his thinking, and I was like, all right, whatever. I think you guys got him frazzled. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's, oh, he's working. What do I, what do, I do? Working extra hard. So, Hey, Dr. Phil, we're going to try to get this on before we get out of here. Dr. Phil... Uh, talks about racist Xbox and cyberbullying. Racist Xbox? Yes. Well, this was something we were talking I, about yesterday. You I guys... bought an Xbox, and uh, uh, I don't see any racism <laughs> going on on the... Uh... I would have to deny that, too. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> they're, they're all playing uh, Call of Duty. Uh, Call of Duty. Four. Four. And, uh, you know, you get the trash talk, but it gets a little ugly in those... Uh, in those rooms, and now Dr. Phil kind of wants to maybe put a stop to this. Well, how is he going to put a stop? Wait, so this to isn't it? something that's in the Xbox. It's stuff that no. the kids are saying to each other yeah. while kids, they're playing. Kids, yes. adults. Well, say me and Anthony were in a room, <laughs> right? If, if, me and an- if, me, if me and yeah. Anthony were in a room, and then the other the other team comes in after, yeah, okay. Yeah. Uh, and then the 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 guy from the other team, you, the first thing out of his mouth is, "Yo, we're gonna kick your asses," you know. Yeah. Then some stuff. Sometimes some people say. 
some stuff after that. Yeah, or, it gets it goes really, it can get racist right, so and homophobic. Yeah. Yeah, also, even though we're so not. Uh, yeah, but, but that's like saying like two guy, a guy goes up to a guy on the street. Yeah. And calls him a Jew or whatever. Yeah. And then uh, so they go, we got to take that street down. Right, right. You know, basically, what it is is <laughs> yeah, just pretty much that's just what he's another saying. meeting place for people to act awful towards each other. Yeah, yeah while they're playing a game. Yeah, but it's got nothing to do Together. with Xbox. It's no, damn good people point, are. Man. No, it's just another <laughs> communication. Yeah. vehicle. Yeah, it it is ridiculous. It's just that white people will call black people those words uh, if they can do it from a safe distance. Yeah, yeah. of course. <laughs> I'll tell you what happens. We're um, in we we in living room. I'll tell you what happens. We play uh, Call of Duty Four, which okay. is one of the best games ever. And uh, Bobby Kelly here General. came up with General Bobby Kelly <laughs> came up with the clan name. They call them clans, by the oh, way. That doesn't yeah. help. No offense, <laughs> but <laughs> it's like a team. And uh, it, uh, ours is G A A Y. Uh, so yeah. it's you know Team Gay oh, so with two on. gays. And yeah. so in front of your name, in little brackets, it says G A A Y, and that yeah. way you know that we're all on one team. Right. So the second we get in a room with another team. They just instantly start. <laughs> yeah, you and it's just nothing but homophobic. Yeah, so, but it does because you're the guys. You guys are owning it. Like you're going right. and calling yourselves. We're calling gay. ourselves the gay, and they're acting like you, <laughs> like you didn't notice that it's spelled well, that it's spelled gay. It, yeah. it doesn't help that we're like, hey guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We kind of we, we greet them when they come into the rooms that, that must way. Make them so mad. And they get very angry. They, and and people don't want to play us. And um. Uh, if there are a team, because there are teams then of specifically Jewish guys, there's the Jews. Their yeah, name right. of the team is Jews. Right. And they'll play, and uh, uh, there's certain um, uh, black teams that'll play. Yeah, right. And, and, and so it turns into all of that. It just turns into gay bashing right. and racial bashing oh, yeah. back and forth. And so Dr. Phil wants to punish. I don't game, know. Well, let's find. Xbox. And he's right. Doctor Phil is right. Let's let's find out. And uh, the greatest part about it is the fact that you're saying these things, which is yeah. fine. Yeah. But you're playing a game that is probably the most violent yeah, game I've ever right. played in my yeah. life. It's fantastically yeah. violent. Right. I love it. And it shouldn't be any other way. But you are blowing people up. The the um. Yeah, but don't call him a faggot. Yeah, yeah. Don't right. say that. Uh, uh, perish the thought. Really. Oh, yeah, uh, they probably would have a oh, problem Jesus. with that. I shouldn't be on this show. <laughs> <laughs> the thing that stinks about the right, game, Lloyd. the game is so politically correct that we're actually still fighting Russians. Right? We were, yeah. Yeah, the only they acceptable got, enemy. It just went to Russia, too. We actually right, yeah. were still fighting Germans up until last year. Oh, my God. Now, <laughs> we're actually fighting <laughs> Russians. Germans are always with, the bad guys. With now, laser but, scopes, but which we didn't even fight them even with Even though you fought, we fought Korea between those two, you can't do Koreans. Can't, no. you can't do, and you can't yeah. do uh, wait, the people. But wait a minute. What about... Yeah, yeah. What no, about Ger Germans and Russians are the only white enemies we've had in the yeah, last but, but, 100 but, years. No, there there are Arabs in there. I played a few games. Headquarters located! Arabs are the hardest board. <laughs> Arabs are, and, and Asians are the hardest boards on video games now. Yeah, Russia yeah. is very easy to that's, beat now. That's because they have Chinese stars. Yeah, and nunchucks. When are people going to learn though that it does? It's not about Xbox. It's not. Nothing's going to. You know, you can't. You can't change racism through. If, nothing's going to change no. until you know two tin black, cans until, and a string. It's, it's, it's yeah, strung no. between a black guy and a white guy. None's yeah. going to help. You're so just you going to get crap. So the black people got to stop stealing, and gay people have to stop <laughs> hurting as, God, as, as, and <laughs> Jews have to stop manipulating the media. And then that you got to get to the root of the problem. As, 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 as soon as anybody but black people. <laughs> admit that there's racism. Uh, no, it's gonna, <laughs> exactly. it's gonna stop when we're, we're all the, the same only, color. It's, it's like we're the we think racism is it's the boogeyman or the Loch Ness monster. <laughs> Nobody white ever exactly. said that. Unless it's a joking man. Exactly. Oh, no, I remember when Venus, <laughs> Venus and Serena Williams complained that they get racist uh, attitudes thrown at them on tour. Right. Like people yell stuff at them during yeah, matches yeah. and stuff. And so they asked uh, Hingis, Martina Hingis, the, the Swiss player mm -hmm. the, that's as white as it gets it's yes, with. Of course. and she said i'm on the same tour and i don't see the racism <laughs> <laughs> yeah they don't really they were they, they reserve it for the oh god those william she's, sisters she's idiot. too busy those, doing drugs those I, william yeah. sisters what? she was just, just because they call right? you nigglet doesn't mean anything <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. all right let's see what dr phil has to say on this subject so right. he did a whole show on this yesterday with the xbox I love playing video games as much as I like eating food. I've been a loyal oh, customer food? of Xbox Live and Xbox 360. Now, it's gotten worse with the ratio slurs, the name calling, and the bullying online. I've been calling you monkey, or your hands greasy, 
from eating all that chicken. I'm gonna put a lynch on your door, or is that your kids in the background? I to stop my children from playing the online games. My 10-year-old daughter, my 13-year-old son, and even my 5-year-old son. And he asked me, Daddy, why I can't play online with you? I want to play that. I go, no, but he goes, why? They're going to call me names, and I think that's sad for a 5-year-old even know that. Oh, boy, here we go. Why you have your oh, kids boy. playing video games, you <laughs> crappy parent? Have they, have they <laughs> played Anthony against... looking at each other like, whoops. Have they played against <laughs> Team Gay? <laughs> Sorry. I didn't mean it. I think they're talking about you guys. <laughs> yeah, oh, exactly. Jesus. You, you're like, oh, I, that was mine. Yeah, oh, boy. <laughs> uh, but I, that, that greasy chicken there, I didn't know he was black. I thought he was just cooking chicken. <laughs> I just thought he played poorly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the control is slipping out of your hand, obviously. <laughs> no. Uh, oh, was, my God. It was Erd Lee. I was calling him cheap. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah. I, well, you know what? The internet it, that that type of thing is just basically a CB radio. Yeah. I mean, it's. It, I mean, it's yeah. you talking to a bunch of guys. You don't know where they are, and, and you, you can't see them either, so you don't know no. what color they are or or Jeez. religion or anything well, you like. Can, that. You can't tell by a voice. Ever. Sometimes you when can. they when their the clan name is the DMX. The last of racism. <laughs> Boy, y'all are trying to find any way to do it. <laughs> I know. I know. You can't do it out in the open no more. You're it's the two. Every time there's a new technology, porn and racism is the first, oh, is the biggest God. thing to come out of it. Thank God. White people just trying to find different ways to be racist. It's just mm -hmm. bothering. And, what, what and you take this stop? away from Think us. Think all the we'll technology we have to invent to be more one. racist. We're <laughs> not that good at anything else. We're gonna. We're, yeah. ama we're amazing at that. What do you mean we're? <laughs> we're I, I don't understand we're. why you keep grouping yourself in, Spick. <laughs> <laughs> you're a red-headed um, plumber. You, you're a farmer. <laughs> yeah, but see, that's the thing. Don't that's pick how my great... spinach. Stop with the weed. <laughs> You're an albino Mexican. <laughs> but that's how that's how powerful that's how powerful whiteness is that it transcends Mexicanness. It does purify everything. It, it? does. <laughs> Just good you can be oh born God. in Africa of African black parents and and have be named Mumbamba if you're white. You know, come on, but join the health club. You know, join the club. Oh, man. Get, get to the front of the bus, my friend. I don't care where you're from. Black yeah. president, no way in no, hell. No. You know how many it arguments won't I've happen. had with my girlfriend over racist remarks I make? She can't really. believe I make them. She's like, would you say that in front of Patrice? Like, well, yeah, yes. in front of me. Of course. Yeah. Not most. By the way, oh, Gavin, no. no. By the she way, must yeah. hate me then. By the, the way, what Patrice must hate me. What Patrice called uh, <laughs> Louis got dumped. You know, you just can't. What? Did it really? Yeah. It's, it wow. got but I was calling Louis that, and he said, it's, okay. It's just ridiculous. <laughs> That's right. a bad one. On That's behalf a bad of all Mexicans, right, I uh, accept the phrase. and Yeah, whatever. Mm -hmm. Let's uh, play no more problem. Dr. Phil audio here. Only if you put N span. I do, it. though, feel for anybody. <laughs> oh, my that. God. You should be hit with a brick. But that was <laughs> yeah, yeah. At least now that everyone knows what the hell we were talking about. <laughs> All right, listen, here we go. Gamer's wife oh tells Dr. God. Phil why she is concerned about this racist stuff going on online. <laughs> so you're worried that he's going to maybe draw these people into the real world. I just, you know, Dr. Phil, I just feel like in the Internet, in this situation, anything is possible. I don't know who these people are. They're claiming to be the KKK, and I have a real big problem with that. You know, they're calling my children monkeys, um, that they're going to hang them, they're going to kill them, they're going to kill me. It, it's it's crazy, and it's out of control, and nobody is trying to do anything about this. But it's my like... husband has contacted Microsoft for many years, and I don't understand why the FBI is not all over the well, FBI. Oh, oh, maybe they should look for, you know, people that want to fly planes into buildings. <laughs> uh, leave the FBI alone. They shouldn't be after Xbox. You're talking about the same thing that you get on the computer. Internet cowards, they're called. They just get on there, bash people, or they're nameless and faceless, and have no courage to confront anybody. And that's all you're getting. I understand how offensive, uh, offensive it is to this woman and her kids and her husband and everything. That's completely understandable. But as far as it actually Actually, being a threat, it's not. These no, I people... think it, no, I think it is. It's, but they shouldn't have their kids playing the game. I mean, is, they're exposing their kids to a lot of bad things. So you think the game no, shouldn't it's be? No, it's got nothing to do with the game. Mm -hmm. It's. I mean, let, the, make no mistake. It's awful. And disgusting yeah. that people go on Xbox and call and play and, other races and just stick with our own. Try to they call and that they call and they you and they go there. They're awful people. <sighs> but but this woman shouldn't have her kid playing it. And it's got nothing to do with Xbox. Again, Xbox is just the street that they met on. It's not. It's just. It's absurd. Yeah. It's it's misused. 
energy to fight in that direction. Like, oh, we got to go right. after Xbox. It's got nothing to do with there's Xbox. So many, there's so many options on Xbox. It's, you can yeah, complain true. about somebody. You can uh, uh, you can actually uh, send something directly to Microsoft about a particular person. You can block, you can their, block so you them. can't hear them anymore. You can mute anybody you want, yeah. and you can run your own room and kick anybody you want out of the room. So. Right. Uh, you know, in the certain times, kids shouldn't play. When we're on, no kids should play. They right. shouldn't be around. They <laughs> shouldn't be on. Children, and you're letting them play. Night. If you have children, and you play, and you're letting your kids play Xbox. You should have your children take well, away. Xbox Sand, online. Your kids like, should be taken away. Right. Racism on uh, Wii bowling. Uh, anything like that on the Wii Mote? No. When you use the Wii Mote to play Wii bowling with those wobble-headed bobble doll characters, no, poor or thing. Wii baseball? No. Can you, can you can you make your own bowling ball to look like somebody's face? Oh, God. <laughs> All right, listen. Doctor Phil makes the brilliant observation that technology is good and it's bad. Good oh, point, Dr. Ooh, wow, mm. Doctor Phil. Technology, there's good and bad. I mean, you enjoy playing this game, right? I'm... You couldn't do that before the technology existed, but it comes with a downside. I'm spending thousands of dollars to Microsoft, so I think, and it's coming inside of my house. Yeah, and so you think they owe you oh, they uh, owe some time. protection? What? Right. <laughs> All right, you're crazy. Yeah, right. Thousands of you're dollars. You're crazy. I don't play online. I I I, you don't? I love artificial yeah. intelligence. Yeah. I love playing the game. The game. I don't like getting online. With online people. is great. Yeah. MySpace people. Real people. Hey, what's your gamer tag? I don't want to play with you. <laughs> no, it's great really? playing real people. Yeah, it's a lot better. You know you're fr when you When you shoot that. someone in the face, you know it's they're sitting in their house just yeah. going, Burr! you know, they're you're, so frustrated. Because that's some, usually me. You're playing against somebody else's, uh, like, psychology. Like, mm. what, if that's low I, the computer that's runs around the, the, the thing, like, eight times. I may run around, stop, and come back and shoot you in the Call face. Call of Duty 4, yeah. just playing it on hard is not hard enough. You're just it's, pissing it's away like your, your brain on that stuff. Yeah, it's, it's just it, the it, worst it, thing for a human being. Uh, I, I love it. I think, look, for you, you're, how old are you now? Um, in my 38. Uh, 40s. You're just coasting to your death. Nobody, no, <laughs> yeah, fine. it's true. There's nothing being well wasted. Fun. <laughs> You've got your career. You make money. <laughs> you go ahead. You've learned everything you want to learn. Yeah. But for Bob Kelly... You look two month, two bad months and you're you're homeless. So you're you're putting your life in danger. Jesus by you. Wow, he just went right <laughs> wow. out of pockets. He, was, he actually Damn. gave you an extra month. <laughs> Somebody with Spanish doubloons in their pocket just told you you're broke. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, listen. Uh, we got two more clips. We want to squeeze in here. Uh, gamer afraid that the people threatening him will find out who he is by googling him. But he's not worried that he's on national TV talking about this. So <laughs> let's uh, listen to this clip. And your fear is they've said, "I'm going to Google you. I'm going to find. I'll find. You got a tag that you use when you're playing. Yeah. That somehow they can trace that back through, get to your account, find out where you live." And, and get to you, Man. and that's a possible. No. that's a possible thing. I mean, that's a yes, real it is, Doctor Phil. Right? My fear is, is my kids uh, targeting my kids, and uh, who knows? I don't know. I mean, if people exactly. write, I think my rights are violated, especially if you're writing KKK and you're uh, actually taking the time to do all this stuff and and, and three letters and stuff, and, and, and <laughs> it's just yeah, it doesn't take much time. It's one key. Black, I think, black, black. I should be able to, think, 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 to there it is. Don't forget caps lock. You have to, <laughs> I should be able to swim in the Pacific Ocean without sharks attacking me. Mm -hmm. I need someone to protect me against these sharks yeah. when I get in that water. Why? How about not getting in the in the water, my friend? Yeah, no, exactly. I should have the. It's my God given right. No, it isn't to get yeah. on the internet and play. Shut play, up. G play games it. rated M also. Yeah. Uh, so the kids shouldn't <laughs> no, be just, playing it. Oh, oh nah. no. Well, <laughs> it said rated M. <laughs> let, me, let me say this. Let me say this to black people, please. Intellectual black people, stop messing around with dumb white people. That's what I'm really getting tired of. Yeah. It's always a retarded white guy and then mm. black people getting ready to go well and then he gets on and it's a it's a travesty yeah. it's like it's these yahoo white boys right calling you a monkey and yeah. you and you're bothered by that <laughs> yeah 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 let's go why to, let's go to kevin in connecticut kevin Sounds like you guys need the Malcolm Xbox. <laughs> <laughs> let's go to travis uh from the bronx travis uh, yeah, I play plenty of Call of Duty all the time. I'm black, and all this racism is just nothing. This guy who's complaining about it, he's a damn wimp. He's a grown man. Yep. Come on now. Hmm. I mean, if people are going to talk trash to you, it's all in good fun. They don't really mean to hurt your feelings. If they do, they you know what they're, uh, yo, dude, you know what they're doing all here? Making a monkey face, all of them. Oh, shut <laughs> up. They all, 
they all put their tongue up into their top lip and they're going. Jimmy's up on the counter. Except, except Jimmy's swinging from a chandelier and throwing bananas at people. We were actually trying to make the face. All right, all right. I thought it didn't say it. Glad I didn't. I use the American History Xbox. That's the one I like to use. Let's go to Mike. Excuse me. In Dallas, or is this Max? Mike. Yes, Mike. What's up, Mike? Hey, uh, I'm a truck driver, and uh, they do the same thing on the CB. They do all the talking noise. We call them CB Rambos. You know, you can't see who they are, but that's all they do is talk. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they did that. I did that coming back from Monterey. My friend had a CB. He goes, watch this. And he goes, is there anywhere a black guy can get breakfast around here? And just, <laughs> oh, just no. I mean, nonstop for an hour and a half. Oh, the, best, the best jokes, some of the best jokes I've ever heard. I mean, really good jokes. No, the like knock-knock jokes and every, I mean, everything. I love the fact that he knew. He goes, watch this. <laughs> done it a few times. The thing is, if you go out to, like, real America where real people are, <laughs> they, the what the all humor is racist. Yeah, every single yeah. that's all people talk about. It's that bad, right? Like I, my, I we have a house upstate in uh, uh, Columbia County, which is a very rural part of New York. And my neighbor, who's a farmer, invited me to watch the Tyson Lennox Lewis fight in his barn. He's got he stole satellite. Wow! <laughs> and so all of my neighbors were all these really nice people. We all went and watched it. And a couple of minutes into the fight, some guy's like, look at them monkeys up there. And they oh, just start. God. And I'm sitting there like, I just feel horrible. And in well, front of you, gonna, what you're, gonna, and what you're like the new guy stamp? there. Yeah, I'm like the New Yorker. Yeah. And they're, you know, but they're all, I realize that that's all they, sh they, they sharpen their humor on racism. It's the only thing they have to make fun of. Wow. Like, that's all they do. All right, we got the final clip here uh, from Dr. Phil. And it's a site on there, a game called Uno. Uh, everybody knows what Uno is. Um, it's actually a live feed. It's four people. Actually, it's, it, it, four people have a, have a camera, and you we can see each other as we play the game Uno. Now you have people on there taking oh. off their clothes and perverted things, <laughs> running around naked. Nice. And, and it's, so, it, it got, naked. it's all about the money now. It's so easy to get online now. You can go to your local 7-Eleven, your liquor store. And buy a month on, uh, <laughs> the, the liquor store, the gun store, the KFC. What the? Come on, dude. Is that a local check? Cash Everybody place. always check has a library. Yeah. Everybody always uh, has a library. I know. <laughs> buy one up you go to the, on the corner. The coffee guy. shop or the <laughs> library. Kennedy fried chicken. <laughs> this guy's no reverend. Hell. He's really trying Jeez. to get something going. This guy's <laughs> burying himself. I get boy, my hats. He stayed on that Uno game long enough to so, notice that they're getting naked. They're by getting the way. naked. He should have turned his computer off immediately. I'm getting Uno. Here's the second half of the clip. <laughs> you can go to your local 7-Eleven, your liquor store, and buy this a month, a uh, year subscription for forty forty nine dollars. You can buy one for seven dollars. This is an and ad. Come for... home, actually type in the code, and you're online. So who's to say my knows son, exactly my daughter, gets online, plays Uno, and it's a pervert online luring her to go do something. So who's at fault? Did he say something? The parents or is it Microsoft if something happens to my kid? Oh my God, shut up. Blame Microsoft. Yeah, go oh ahead. God. How about this? People to get online you're... and stuff like that, you got to use your real name and identity. How about that? No. No, why no. not? That ain't going to happen. Because you'd be arrested, I'd be in jail. No, no, but I'm saying, like, where else? <laughs> <laughs> there are other places. You know what is? Where else can you interact without any real facial recognition? The Internet's a weird place. Like, any other time. It's also, it's not yeah. just, as as, uh, as uh, Patrice deftly put it, uh, retarded white folk. <laughs> it's also supposedly smart. Like, the, with the writer's strike, there's, like, this online sort of forum of people talking about it and they're all like writers and like you know millionaires yeah mm -hmm. arguing about it and like i went on once and just and questioned something the writers guild oh, was doing boy. and they're just like you piece of God. like i mean i never gotten sworn at so much in my life yeah and just say you should have your this and that torn open and just and these are like guys with jobs yeah. and mansions. <laughs> all of a sudden and, they come oh, out with anonymous names yeah you know it just says writer o2 and well, that's just it is. like you're yeah. a piece of there's guy. zero accountability that's all it online is. and all everyone is. knows that so you could say whatever you want yeah. and you, there's no responsibility no. i was in a chat room one time and someone said something i didn't like it. i'm like oh jump in a lake hey uh, oh hey oh, oh, my easy God. hey jimmy uh bring us home get uh get everyone's plugs out here will you all right uh well this week i'm in pennsylvania next week i'm at the borgata it's sold out it's been a great week. Uh, thanks a lot. No, everybody uh, else. Uh, uh, oh, sorry. Uh, Patrice uh, is going to be tonight and tomorrow at Governors in Levittown, Long Island. Uh, four shows, two tonight, two tomorrow. Bobby Kelly will be at Caroline's tonight, 1030, tomorrow, 1030, Sunday, 8 o'clock. It's 212-757-4100. And Stupid's Comedy Central special comes out <laughs> January 18th 
And Patrice's Def Jam is this Sunday, am I correct? His uh, Def Jam will be on this Sunday night. On HBO. HBO. On HBO, of course. And uh, Young Louis C.K., I don't remember your plugs. Uh, February 14th in Buffalo, 15th in Cleveland, 16th uh, uh, Detroit. Detroit. Okay. Miami on Wednesday. Nobody cares. Okay. And Gavin will be... Uh, what was the word? Strapping. No, what was the word Bobby used? Blasting. Blasting. <laughs> Gavin will be blasting his way all over uh, Manhattan for the next couple of Wrecking months. Wrecking sofas all over. <laughs> <Right. Saturday. laughs> He's using pulp of women on sofas. <laughs> oh, basil tea. Thank you, Tom. Yes. For all the great food. Uh, where, 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 where? Uh, Hooper Avenue and Tom's River. Delicious. Bas uh, Amazing. Uh, bas basil teas, brew pub and grill. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Delicious. All right, we're over, uh, going over to XM. You guys have a great weekend. Dave. Talk to you Monday. This is the Opie and Anthony Show. <laughs> Opie and Anthony. Opie and Anthony. Opie and Anthony. It's the Opie and Anthony Show. Hi. <laughs> Thud, thud, thud. Here. Squeaky mic stands. Loud headphones. There we go. Hi. All right, we made it over to XM Satellite Radio. We got rid of the annoying one, and uh, and now we can broadcast. But wait, I don't see Jimmy here. No. I'm talking about Patrice. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but Gavin's here to make sure we don't say too many bad things about him. <laughs> He'll report back to Patrice. He sure will. Yeah. Uh, we got Club Soda Kenny. He's in the middle of the studio over there. Where's Jimmy? Where Probably. Jimmy what do uh, you? What do you? You look like the announcer for a show over there. And now, yeah, why don't you do our the big announcement for the XM show? Good morning, people. Uh, why really? would the mic why be on? Why would it? You should have a musical that you do. Why would it work? <laughs> yeah. Why? Why would it? I work? try again. And here's. <laughs> Jimmy! <laughs> <laughs> Look how awful he looks. He's all by himself, way over there with his, his stupid granny glasses on. fucking awful glasses. One chair, there. one mic in front of him on a mic stand. Like he's Ed McMahon. Yes. And now, back to you, Opie. No, no, that's not how it goes. You gotta just announce the whole show. Thank you, Anthony. No, no not individually. <laughs> as a collective. Yes. Da, 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 da. It's the Opie and Anthony show. Starring Always. our good friends Opie and Anthony, and guest starring guest star James Norton. He's not guest day. starring. Jesus I'm not a, Christ! I'm, I'm like fucking Steve Lawrence. Please Still just <laughs> stick to hitting people that are trying to say hi to Jim. <laughs> <laughs> well, Kenny's here because uh, the dump report. Yes. Oh, this is gonna be a, a yeah. this is gonna be a fucking Lulu. It's gonna be longer I than mean, the show name. you just did. <laughs> how many how many dumps did we get on the other side? <laughs> Ten dumps. Ten dumps. Ten. Oh, wow. Yes. Banner day. Nine to one. I'm gonna say nine. Louis. One. Howard. I didn't, I didn't take one. That eight many to times. two. Yeah. One. I'm gonna say eight. Lou. One. Patricky. One. Fucking. Howie. I think I, I got dumped for. I think I said scumbag. You got dumped for something you were thinking. That's how strong yeah, you were. Yeah, I know. I was really are. fucking <laughs> thinking it. I said shit. <laughs> I, think, I, think I said something so racist that the air goes blank. It's like, wow, what holy a, shit. Yeah. I said shit during one of your live reads. Did you? Oh, yeah. I, I <laughs> well, it's like you lost money on that. Oh, dump. I saw you go like this. Oh, yeah. My mic wasn't on, it. but in the background, I was, I was mm. discussing something with Jimmy, and I'm like, yeah, and that, sh that fucking shit, and blah, blah, blah. And you're in the middle of doing a live read mm -hmm. for, for Tigers or something. But. I was like, yeah. The, uh, the gyms you go to are shit. I said cunt okay. lips, but they took it in context and left. So they were fine with it. Oh, thank God yeah. for that. Because you're uh, saying how nice cunt lips are. Yes. All right, let's, uh, let's play the sweeper. Right. The funny thing about the dump report, Louie's like, I'm trying to be better for you guys. But <laughs> but uh, take note that probably all of these dumps are Louie's. I just, know. Just about. Live from the Opie and Anthony Show Studios, the Daily Dump Report. Yeah, Anthony was a good boy. He didn't make the list. All right. He didn't I, I. Yeah. I know. Oh, what Jimmy didn't either. Yeah, no, no, you're professional. Oh, of course we are. Oh, yeah. Good. All right. Sure. First one, 7.15 a.m., Patrice O'Neill, so I can piss. Oh, that's uh, right. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. so dumb. You can't say piss? No. 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 8.07. But piss is Louis delicious. C.K. Mm. De de debuts. Yeah. <laughs> what if you really... No, excuse me. 
Break <laughs> when does he oh, de- de- debut? <laughs> oh, 807 God. Louis C.K. What if you have really sticky poo? Really? Yep. Yeah. It's a sticky poo? poo. You can say poo, you just can't describe yes. the poo. Because when you're trying to target men Whoa. 18 to 49, you don't want to yeah. describe dirty. They're going to call in and say they didn't like Duty. that truck. I, I'm a truck driver. I didn't appreciate that sticky poo. <laughs> sticky I ain't listening poo. no more. <laughs> That's pretty much the first word kids learn is poo, yeah. but we're not allowed to say There's it on the radio no, show. There's no, every sticky kid poo. says it. Parents refer to their fucking shit as poo. Uh, it, it's not. I, oh I would defy. The FCC to fucking actually find someone for saying sticky poo. Uh, yep. All right. But what else? Cool scary radio. cats. And 808, Louie backed it up with, things <laughs> come violently rocking out of our ass. Rocketing, you motherfucker. Are, you, are they rocking out of your ass? Like on a chair? Rocketing. Yeah, that's what I said, didn't I? Rocketing, oh. yeah. he said. That's what I meant. Yeah, that's rocking. funny. Rocking isn't funny. No, it's, no. It means no. like there's an old lady on a log just fucking back and forth, <laughs> yeah. sipping a fucking lemonade, <laughs> trying to smush it down. A ten, Howie Mandel said, "Fuck you." Ooh, Howie. Yeah. That's, that's, a, that's gray area. That's the deal or no deal, yeah. Howie Mandel. Yeah. Said fuck. A twelve, Louis C K. Oh, Jesus. And this is a comment <laughs> hey, here, editorialized in reference to a sheet that was used for sex. Louis C.K. said, one bloody-eyed ghost. Yeah. Well. And, and he never said sex. No. But I, I listened to Tom's logic. I know why they dumped it, even though I, I didn't agree with it. But it was like, uh, I can't kill him for that one. Because he's like, no, no, the sex. The, he went through the whole discussion. And it, it's like, at least they think he wasn't completely, like, fucking sticky poo. Yeah, Childish. Well. <coughs> right. Tom's a smooth talker, though. That's going to be my, is, my he, rap name, too. One, but, blo- one bloody-eyed ghost. <laughs> but he's actually <laughs> from the album Collaborating Sticky Poo. Collaborating with Sticky Poo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But there are times where Tom will go, no, that shouldn't have been dumped. You know, that yeah. was one. He's like, no, no, I told him to dump that. Oh. No, mm. I, I on that show and with who was in that room and what was being discussed, the dumps... <clears throat> You know, I would chalk that up to like uh, one of those one of those National Guardsmen at Kent State that shot those. Kids. <laughs> yeah, hey, you don't you know, really play. They were, look, they were charging. He put I a think. flower in my gun rifle, my rifle, <laughs> and then he he threw a you know lit a firecracker. What am I going to do? I shot him. Sorry. <laughs> right. Tough that, situation. Kenny just goes right. Yeah. Go ahead. Because oh. Kenny wants to talk some. What more. shitty <laughs> station is doing this? Hannah Montana contest. <laughs> Men dress in drag for Hannah Montana oh. tickets. <laughs> and it, it's some kind of a uh, uh, goofy, wacky radio. Eddie interrupted. Promotion. Bob oh. had a Sorry. doozy. Bob, Sorry. go. <laughs> <laughs> you you asshole! I didn't see you put a little <laughs> pressure on what he said. I had nothing. I just thought of you down there trying to pick somebody up, and somebody's stealing your glasses. <laughs> That's a great story, man. Oh, That's man. fantastic. That's Give me those motherfucker. <laughs> no, nope, just took it for wasting my time. Sorry, go ahead, Ken. Louis again, a twelve, oh. one pussy, bloody eyed yeah, ghost. Well, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. very descriptive. Eight eighteen, Louis C K. Mm-hmm. Douchebags. That's one that oh, never right. should be done. Never, right. never. That's not your fault. 836, Louis C.K. <laughs> Mr. Common Denominator. Referencing Bob Kelly's Call of Duty 4 team gay, Louis C.K. said, faggot. Never oh, should be dumped. Never, never, never should, should be, be dumped. dumped. Never should you have been should dumped. should never call us faggots either. We're gays. Every time I clear my throat to talk, they put their finger nah, on the button. Should never should have been dumped. <laughs> That's yeah. just fucking pussy thinking. Yeah, faggot thinking. Yeah, hey, yeah. man. 840, Patrice Spick. Oh boy! Another one that should not have been done. No, Tom didn't know you were Mexican, and right. it's like it shouldn't matter. But that's the way they think over them. Like, dude, it was a racial discussion. They're parodying racism. Stop it! So yeah. if there's yeah. a spick in the room, you can yeah. say spick. That's the mentality. So. Of what do you expect? It's all white guys running things. Just yeah, they're thinking. doing doors. I am a spick, and I approve of this message. <laughs> 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 so they need that. You have to say it like, like I approve of this message. <laughs> I approve of this message, Senor. <laughs> Does anyone really talk like that? Not a single Mexican in the world. I love that. (laughs) Yes, senor. Si, senor. Si. Uh, I got boogies in my nose. (laughs) (laughs) Do you want a drum roll for the last one since Uh, we're supposed to do sound effects? We're not supposed to do sound effects over here. I know. What was it? I know. Last one, 846, Louis Uh C.K. Pissing away your brains. <laughs> what? But that isn't that's even like not that's not that's even not... about the frothy yellow drink, that right? Jimmy, that that's is like Jimmy's staple. Pissing of his away diet. your time or <laughs> pissing away. Pissing uh, away is a verb. Break. Break. Fucking once. I mean, All right. look. 
context, that, asshole. That's context. The dumb right. guys. Like I know it's a tough gig, but, but he's got to learn. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Yep. Pissing yeah. away your brain. Everyone and I'm talking knows. about people shouldn't have their kids use X Xboxes. Uh, that's exactly like because you say, they're pissing away their brain, and that's they yeah. dump that. Come on, dude. It's the same context as uh, saying, uh, "Don't give me that crap." You know, right. I don't to take any crap from from her, or she crapped on my face. Yep. You can't say she crapped on my face, but you could say, "Don't I don't take any but more." But pissing crap. away isn't even actually referring to the bathroom at yeah. all. Yeah, it, it it's actually using the verb like as if you could piss, uh, you know, money. I mean, it doesn't make sense. Yeah, you could say pissed off. I was so pissed off yesterday. You could say that. I've never heard they of don't that dump being it. Uh, dumped anywhere, pissing away your... No, it shouldn't be dumped anywhere. That's, it's fucking right, that's revolting. Maybe he thought the brain could actually work its way into the bladder. Right, and then come and, out as piss. And you were pissing... He you know, just talking about saw the brain, brain tissue coming just, out of the tip of my cock. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just saw you mixing with the shit button. and semen that Your I just big red put on bush, a, yeah. a hole in a sheath, <laughs> <Your> freckled cock. <laughs> exactly, that just disturbed him. That's right. <laughs> Look, I get it. Uh, well, you it's tried funny. though today, Louis. That's well, the I know, thing. man. It's, it's bad. bad. It's bad. I hurt. So I'm hurting you guys. No, there's a few that you shouldn't nah, have done. On, no, but it's a ma it's a critical mass issue. <laughs> and <laughs> like you could give me. XM it's like it. when a guy gets mad uh, at the ump for take you know for punching him out. You swung at strikes one and two, so you can't. You put you said you know what I mean. Yeah. Like I can't. You know I said cunt and nigger about five times. <laughs> so <laughs> sure, when I said piss, the guy started. And you can't go me. like, ah, oh, you know. Yeah, come on! Come on! <laughs> come on! I'm just watching Gavin, making sure he doesn't get pissed at you. <laughs> <laughs> you spit out nigger with ah. the, the extra nigger. And then you did it twice. Well, yeah. I said, yeah, it, I said it in go. a kooky way. So. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he said it in a kooky He's way. Is black? Is he black? Yeah, black. yeah not black that up. Nigger. Half black, half white. Half yeah. black, yeah. half white. Yeah, yeah. yeah so are we That makes you black. So are we all. The noise of the... The repressors. Yeah. Census Bureau. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the eyes of <laughs> the census Bureau. <laughs> but I'm saying they, they would count as black. Sure. All right. Yeah. I'll get you. Yeah, they would count as black. <laughs> we have I'm a, saying uh, they do. Uh, count. Government allows you that. What's that? It's a little yeah. bit different over here. <laughs> <laughs> we, got, we got another song from Val Kilmer, everyone. Oh. Uh, this guy's good, man. Do we have the one from yesterday to play oh, for the guys? Oh, we got to hear the beginning of that Just one, Val least. Kilmer? He's a good singer. Val Kilmer is um, going into uh, uh, music. He's oh, singing. Jesus. He does, uh, does a uh, Neil Young cover. <laughs> Hey, can I have another water bottle, please? There's a fucking layer of film on my water bottle. Ugh. I just want a non-filmy water. What do you mean? Well, you gotta be specific when you ask what do you for mean water. Film. Yeah. Touch it. Can I get a I'm water? I'm drinking out of it. Touch it. With your, oh, we just got touch it. Well, <laughs> it's, it's from <laughs> it's, angry it's from Jimmy you peeling the fussy. sticker off. No, it's not. The sticker doesn't go to the bottom of the bottle. You fucking hump. I know where a sticker goes. <laughs> I <laughs> peel the sticker off so I can hold this. Yeah, it's all right. cloudy yeah. feeling. <laughs> Bob's <laughs> trying to back you up, but he can't. He tell can't these people it. that that fucking work with us that fucking Norton gets a non-cloudy bottle. <laughs> uh, Jesus. Are right, you guys? He's an angry man today. Fucking diva. I'm overtired. Man. Kenny's yeah. running somewhere to get a napkin and a new bottle oh, of I'll water. I'll do it. I need, I need water without film. I stayed up last he night. He doesn't like the film this time. Jerking a limp cock. Oh, just awful. Oh, it was awful. The head's just bouncing around. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want from me? Your cock is like. <laughs> Give me a second. Thanks. Jesus. Let me check it for you before it's you not cut. Contact. I can feel uh, it. Yeah, you can, you can drink that one. I don't want that. Stop angry. Stop exactly. putting the water down. There's a fine line between the time uh, you can jack off and when your arm gets tired. Yeah. Oh, there's a fine line. Now, when you there. jack your car until there's so many raw spots on it, yeah. you gotta kind of grab it awkwardly. Yeah. And you have to actually put your finger in the, yeah. in the hole and hook it. Because yeah. yeah. there's so many stingy, stingy red spots on it. <laughs> Way too much. <laughs> fucking. <laughs> so it fucking starts the bleeding and you use that for a loop. <laughs> oh. I actually, t I, I I jerk off with my left hand, and ever since I got yeah. married, Why? I just feel uncomfortable because my wedding Are you ring. Left handed? <laughs> I have to take my wedding ring off now, and really? it just makes me feel bad. Are you a lefty? Yeah, I'm Switch a lefty. I write with my right hand, but I jerk off with my left. Yeah, what a mm. fucking creep! <laughs> Why? Is that it? I'm a creep. Yes. Why? Why is you that jerk creepy? off with your left hand? Who does that? I'm of the same school, Bob. <laughs> you jerk off you with your left hand. Do, you can't do it. It's not. You don't have the coordination. No, not it at goes all. all 
whack it. Not mine. Yeah, They're all like over it. the place. Her own thing does the same thing. Yeah, so. yeah. It's a sign of intelligence. I write no. righty, I, and I'm very awkward. Yeah, it's too yet. awkward. Yeah. What left hand reversal? Oof. Now you're talking no. nice, right? Left, no, it's yeah. like how left handed people. Your balls. <laughs> yeah. When left handed <laughs> people write, they write from above the words, you know? Oh, it looks ridiculous when left handed people write. Yeah. Yeah. This They're is like, wrong. Hand this is, is wrapped wrong. around like a cobra. Like right yeah. backwards. Like, yeah, yeah. Like a little, looks like a little. <laughs> 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 that must be what it's like when they jerk off. Like, you gotta yeah. come around yeah, like as if trying to pretend it's a right hand. They come first, then they like put the semen back in the dick. Fucking smudging over everything. Fucking hate lefties. Time for some Val Kilmer. <laughs> so, you know, he got, yeah. So, the, so Val Kilmer, he he's he wants to be a musician, right? He's good, man. He's got like five or six songs on his my, on his yeah, MySpace. Not. Yeah, and he's trying to get a record deal. And what I'm about to play is a piece of "After the Gold Rush," the famous Neil Young song mm -hmm. that he what, that he re-recorded. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But then we got a brand new one for everybody. We got a brand new cool, Val man. Kilmer song. But listen right. to a oh, piece no. of this. What? That's the remix. The original is in the mass computer. I'm sorry. Eric just told me to tell you that. Is that what oh, you just boy. said? Oh, boy. What? So this is a remix, meaning you guys remixed oh, it? Oh, yeah. No. What, this is the super mix? Yes. Oh, yeah, we don't God. want the super mix. Why would I want that? We want the... You need oh, a straight line yeah. first. e -rock. <laughs> What did E-Rock do? Oh, e -rock. Hold on. Let's, let's give him the benefit of that. E-Rock, what'd you do? Here, he's running in. Let's ask him. He might have... We can't just throw E Rock under the bus. Sure no, the originals were set up like Oak wanted, and I gave Fan the remix and said in case he wants that one too. And Where's the original? Had. The original is. Yeah, right we just there. want the original today. All right, whatever. All right, oh. now go go do all the exercise you'll do for the next month by running out there and grabbing it. <laughs> Congrats, you almost did something right today. Sorry, that was a cheap shot. Oh, very close to right. I try to go to bed for Eric. Uh, I hate him. I hate him at this point. <laughs> <laughs> all right, hey, uh, so here's Val Kilmer doing Neil Young's After the Gold Rush. Well, I dreamed I saw the night in armor come. <laughs> what the fuck? Yes, <laughs> something the Indian from Natural Born Killers. <laughs> <laughs> you Is he kidding? No. No, that's just that sincere. Yeah, it gets yeah. better though. Oh my god. Oh, this is horrible. This Oh my god. It was floating on the breeze. That's right. Look at Mother Nature on the run in the 21st century. Oh, gotta kill yourself. Has to update it. Right, right. <laughs> Look at Mother Nature got it, on the run in the 21st century. What an asshole. I've, I've, I've actually heard fucking women queef songs. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> than this. Fucking makes fucking Dane Cook sound like an actual oh, singer. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, don't you talk about my boss like that. Sure Hold on. I will. His driver's going to take issue sure with you. I'm <laughs> <laughs> not driving anymore. Yeah. The guy who checks him yeah. into his hotel is going to get mad. <laughs> Torgasm 2 might be happening, so we're going to keep low on this one. Oh, really? <laughs> no, you asshole. I'm kidding. Why would you say no? That was a massive success. Yeah, it was. No, it wasn't. For him. It was horrible. <laughs> <laughs> no, we watched it. It was terrible. I know. I, it was after my show. I saw the ratings every week. Oh, Less oh. people watch it every week. Anyway, oh, it was a, it was a, it was anyway, but Val Kilmer. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. Val, no, we're talking about Wait Val a Kilmer. minute, Lou. Hold on. Yeah. Hold on. I, I'd love to defend it, but I really can't. I was on a show with Jay Davis. You were great on that show, there's no doubt. Oh. But the show was not successful. It was a disaster. No, yeah. But then but you get lucky. I didn't get have a lot of viewers. I didn't What's get that? fucking. They dumped no, we us had too. a lot of viewers. That's exactly right. That life sucks. I didn't make a yeah. dime. I was. So, I got two points on the DVD, and I was mm -hmm. actually hoping that he might sell a lot of DVDs, and uh, it didn't. Um, my lawyer called, and he, you know, you know, uh, the lawyer. My lawyer's Chunk from the Goonies. Yeah, he's a lawyer now, and oh, he's the same lawyer. But he's just ridiculous. He's like an aggressive lawyer. He's just an ass. And I was like, this guy's gonna get me some money. He called back nothing. You no. made nothing. They sold yeah. nothing. No. Nothing. Not no, money. we used to get the ratings every week, and they'd show us the whole HBO lineup. It would be Entourage, and then us, and then uh, uh, Torgasm. And we were ticking up every week a little bit, but Torgasm was dumping really hard. Like, there was one point where... <laughs> Torgasm would go down, and then a shitty like movie from like with whoever in it, Jan Michael uh, Vincent. Yeah, like a Jan Michael <laughs> Vincent movie that it came on after at yeah. like twelve midnight would go up. 
from what Torgasm was getting. Oh, wow. Yeah. Zero people oh, watched. That's not good. Yeah. No, it was a very poorly done show. Why don't we fucking... But, do Bob, but Bob, Bob I used to watch it because I like... But I didn't really know what you that Dennis well. Dennis Hopper want? And I got to like you from watching you on that show. You you came out well. Yeah. You acquitted yourself nicely <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> on that show. But... Hold, hold on. Who, what is fucking? Uh, What's going on? What is there? Barry Slotnick? <laughs> 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 fucking doing? What is oh, going on? I don't, I don't know, know what he is. Pointing and, and it's like a zoo. <laughs> looking at stuff. What are those people doing? Who is that it's creep? Ridiculous. They're looking at. Hey, hold on. I, I want to know They're what fucking. Uh, out there. Hey, what is the father from Family Ties want in this studio? <laughs> 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 Why is my Republican son shaking all over the place? <laughs> 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 Oh, what is this creep? What does he want? No, no. enough. I so we, a little we get it. Too. We got today's Val Kilmer song. It's fucking oh, personal. It's a new one. Kilmer, Jesus. That's great, right? I have a weird story about Val Kilmer, and I'm not sure I should tell it, but I'm going to anyway. Tell it. We love you. Because this is kind of private. But uh, Chris Rock told me that he got a call once from Val Kilmer, got his number through channels mm -hmm. of famous people channels. Yeah. He no doesn't know. Both are. And he called him and left a message like, hey, man, uh, Let's hang out sometime. I want to know if you want to hang out and go to a game or something like that. And, and Chris was like, I don't fucking... Do you think just because we were both in movies once, you can just call me and I'll hang out with you? <laughs> like, I guess celebrities do that. But yeah, for some yeah. reason, that instance of it really rubbed him wrong. <laughs> that it's Val Kilmer thinks... Like he's the president. Like he yeah, could just he get just folks on the phone and hang out with them. Like he was watching Chris on TV and thought, "Yeah, I'm going to go to the game with that guy tomorrow." Yeah. I'm Val Kilmer. We both yeah. work in the same industry. <laughs> yeah, very. It's vaguely. like a steel worker just calling another steel worker. And <laughs> yeah. going, hey, you want to <laughs> hang out? Let's go to the party. Yeah, but you got to love like Chris. Like Chris is on. Like his immediate honesty. My yeah. my response time is like three days later. <laughs> right. I'd be I'd be in the movie theater or hanging out with this jackass and uncomfortable. Know, why, why am I here? Yeah, yeah and then I'd, I'd I'd be home having the argument by myself. Dude, yeah. Val. First of all, don't. You said Val. No, Chris don't is call Chris is a very. <laughs> don't even try to say you wouldn't fucking latch on a Val of Kilmer's yeah, dick. Yeah, that's in exactly what I said. That I would in a minute. I'm, I'm that's exactly my no, point. You said your response time is three days later. You would be saying, "Why am I hanging out with Val?" You'd be like, "Val, Val, Val the new Val Kilmer on your phone." No, I was. I was Val would be playing Call of Duty yeah. Four. What? Chris is a very <laughs> Chris guy, is a very real Kilmer. guy. And I was I was with Chris once in an Aspen for the comedy festival, and. uh some people grabbed us, some promotion people, me and Chris. We're just out on the street in Aspen, and, and they kind of corralled us into this designer store, this really, really expensive, like, $600 shirt store. Ooh. And they said, uh, take whatever you want, like, because they wanted Chris to wear their right, stuff. Yeah, wow. yeah. And I'm standing with them, so they said it to both of us, nice. take whatever you want. And Chris is a very classy guy, so he was like, you know what, give me a T-shirt. I don't like, he just doesn't oh, want to no. take. He doesn't want to be a pig. He goes, just give me a t shirt. I don't want to take this nice stuff. What did Joey Louie do? I, 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 said, I, said, <laughs> I made them fucking unpadlock a leather jacket and I took it. I'm like, give me that oh, jacket. Oh, wow. And, and yes. the woman, like, Paul, this British woman, she's like, okay. And oh, she fucking. Oh, you know she didn't want to. No, she did not want to Good at all. For her. And I'm like, because he's like, he's in a place like that every day and he has discretion, but I'm like, I may never <laughs> yeah, have this opportunity again. again. I'm, I'm like, give leather. me a leather They have to take the alarm <laughs> off the they had, to, they had to disarm the alarm. <laughs> How much was <laughs> the, the jacket? Worth? jacket? Oh, that thing fucking, had to be it's ridiculous. It's the greatest jacket in the world. How much are these worth? Gotta be the jacket. Bucks. What? Okay. No, Perhaps it's a lot more than that, Jim. Perhaps, probably like a, at least twenty five hundred bucks. I think. Wow, yeah. When we were doing oh, the com the Vegas them. Comedy Festival nice. for uh, with Dane, they uh, promised they because we were with Dane and we went to this. We were supposed to go to this party. We were going to get free Sony Vios. Oh, me, Gary, yeah, yeah. And Dane. Oh. We got those from that. Yeah, you got <laughs> them. Yeah, got but, Dave, but Dane was like, uh, we weren't going to make the flight or the party, and he was like, ah, you know, we're going to do. It was a but the party. only thing in my head was like, I gotta. Get to Vegas. I need my free computer. <laughs> yeah, I got. So I, like, I got the free computer. I got it too. And it's sitting in my closet. But I had, I had a really. I'm push a piece of shit because my dad. To my dad's pretty poor. Like he doesn't make a lot of money. And uh, I said to him because I got that Vio and I call. It, I am a Mac guy. I have no use for it. And I said I have a, a new Vio. Do you want it? And he's like, that would really be a big help to me. And I just haven't sent. Yeah, it. Yeah, uh, it, so. shit. It's sitting there. No one's using it. Oh, it's such a great are, computer. My own too. father. It isn't even like I could donate it to a school actually and like yeah, help yeah. kids. My own father, who like works for very little money, 
It's just sitting I'm there. I'm like, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, Dad, shit. Yeah, I'll send it. How Sorry. could you not help the man that blasted a load into your mother while she was sleeping? <laughs> In Mexico. Because <laughs> he's Mexican. Because he's a filthy Mexican. <laughs> he doesn't deserve anything. All right. Hey, oh, go back to Mexico and get a computer. <laughs> go back to Mexico and invent a computer out of oh, beans, you fucking you... <laughs> smelly spick. <laughs> why, why do you need it? You're not going to be able to plug it in. I know. <laughs> you live in a hut. <laughs> yeah, exactly. What are you going to power it with your fucking That's funny. Mexican? To so get to the next line, you have to hit make the a dirt key. Out of, yeah, <laughs> a dirt key. <laughs> You're only going to use it to fucking, you know, cross the border with <laughs> somehow. That's true. You're going to close the case over yourself and hide this. <laughs> You're going to use it as a hat to block the sun in the fields. <laughs> Open it like a heavy V. <laughs> Put it on your stupid, non-thinking head. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, Christ. <laughs> Are we ready for the Val Kilmer song? Oh, I like oh, well, Val Kilmer. Another this one, right? Terrific. New one. T today's song is called Hold On to Daddy. Oh, him with the daddy. I like that. I think that's nice. He's got to say what it is with his daddy. Yeah. Do it, I'm gone. Where did he sing this? I know. Larry Craig sitting there tapping his foot next to him in the shower. Wow. <laughs> Get a studio on the back of a flatbed. A fucking asshole. Jesus Christ. It's <laughs> horrid. He's just not there, is he? Hey, the recording studio's not good. Where would you like to work? Uh, do you have a room with aluminum and tin on the wall? That would be perfect. Because you're going to cry. He's kidding. What's he doing? I don't know. When I'm gone. Uh, when I'm gone, I wish you were gone. Yeah. When I'm gone, when I'm gone, you gonna cry? Uh, I think she's cry so. when you sing. He's very bluesy. Okay. This guy's got some soul, man. Yeah, yeah, he doesn't like it. What? Yeah. In the free zone. Got the soul of a Doc Martin put against his head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just there couldn't be real. <laughs> Was there coughing in this? <laughs> this has to be a cool. booth. He's coughing. Sounds like someone's trying to take the guitar away from him. There's <laughs> <laughs> a fight going on. What? You can turn your back and watch the sun go down? How? My God. Coast West. Please. You're not wow. saying anything. Is he asleep for the mic? <laughs> Right, we get it. All right, talk about daddy again, would you? I'm crying happy, happy daddy Okay, another song, down. Yeah, yeah, just keep cranking them out there, you fuck. <laughs> <laughs> fucking asshole. What happened to the ice man? Uh, yeah, I used to like him, and now fucking hope his kids get a blood disease. <laughs> <laughs> I need a transfusion, and it gives him AIDS on top. <laughs> wow. Fucking asshole. You do not like him at all. Yeah. <laughs> oh, bad music. None, yeah, none more insulting than bad music. It makes you mad. <laughs> my kids got sickle cell. <laughs> it really does make you angry. Yeah, it does. I think He's Especially the fa a famous guy going. He's no, this is good. I'm putting this out there. Yeah, he's not kidding. Is he really serious, dude? He's, he's crazy. Really into being I've Jim seen him on yeah. back in the day. I've yeah. seen him on interviews mm. and stuff on uh, late night talk shows and stuff, and he's he's like crazy. Okay. Yeah. He uh, he he's a hard interview. Like the people. The are thing struggling. that people don't get is that actors are jocks. They're yeah. not. Yes, they, they are. They, they play interesting people, and you attribute that interestingness to them. Yeah. They're not. They're not jocks. They're writer. people that have this weird 
rubber ability with their face and their voice, and they're not, they're just sieves. <laughs> and you can get them to do shit, but then you listen to them talk, this guy's a fucking idiot. And there's I mean, nothing there. Yeah. <laughs> they're just dippy, stupid, flaky assholes. But they can act like real just, cool yeah, people. They can act like real people. There's nothing to prevent yeah. them from being someone else. That's can't right. they, but can't you just act like that all the time? Just yeah, act. you think well because they actually well like watch Actor Studio when they're yeah. talking like they, and they let their hair down amongst yeah, yeah. each other and you just want to drop a bomb on the entire building <laughs> <laughs> and nothing would nothing bad would uh, come of it. Huh. Shitheads. I feel bad for his wife having to lie to him every day. Uh, it's great, it's honey. Great. It's well, she probably thinks it, it is great. If he's a, that much of an asshole that he's saying that, his wife's a stupid cunt. Just by <laughs> deduction, I can just tell you by the transitive law that his wife is a retarded cunt <laughs> with shit ears. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Fucking married that faggot, uh, you stupid cunt. <laughs> Ah. Bad music. Uh, it makes you madder. It does make you mad. Oh. <laughs> He's not <laughs> completely angry. Yeah, That's what I think happy. when I hear so a bad song is whoever's singing this, his wife is Why? a cunt. <laughs> <laughs> and his kids deserve to die. We're going to take our first break on XM. Uh. Don't Maybe. forget, uh, Bob Kelly's at Caroline's all weekend long. 212 757 4100. But Bob's got an odd schedule. Tonight at 10 30, Saturday 10 30, <laughs> Sunday at 8 p.m. That's it, Jimmy. Oh, okay. And, um. And Louis's going to be in Buffalo, Cleveland, and Detroit in the Starting near future. February 14th. 14th, 15th, Website? and 16th. Yep. Website for these days. LouisCK.com. I'm all over the. I'm on tour heavily this He's on MySpace, too, every day. MySpace. So on the front cover. Slash Louis oh, yeah. CK. And yeah. what about Gavin? Where are you going to be? Uh, just walking around Manhattan. So you're gonna be blasting chicks <laughs> or what? Blasting, chicks. blasting what white girls. I'm in Miami on Wednesday. I keep having, forgetting hey, to say that. Hey, Miami, you know what? Knoxville, that, Louisville. Okay, yeah, that guys. brings up something so because we had to keep it clean on the other side. So yeah. you got to retell that story now that we're on this side. What you were hearing and shit. Oh, the oh. other room? Yeah, so it's it's your wife's best friend from Well, Boston. she was on the rag, too, which is disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> he, 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 missed that bit out, oh, he just fucking <laughs> blasted her with Wait, a bloody white hear girl pussy. So what? This is a long time ago, man. Wait, your wife's best friend comes down from Boston? Uh, wife's best friend comes down from Boston. <laughs> she's, you know... You know, she's a little innocent. Leaving yeah, a trail like, of blood. She's, she looks like Rhoda. <laughs> she, she looks like, like Rhoda. Rhoda. She's leaving Rhoda. <laughs> oh, you know, and Jesus. she comes down and... Apparently she likes the uh, the black dudes. Yeah, yeah. She's got a hunkering, a hunkering for a big black cock. It's a yeah. hankering, <laughs> <Yeah>. dummy. <Yeah. laughs> exactly. A hunkering. I like hunkering though. I could relate to that. So. I was actually it's mispronunciation you know, Friday. Uh, it actually is. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So so go point and laugh go Friday. fuck yourself, Air Supply. <laughs> I, Air Supply. <laughs> you do look like the lead singer. What? I, oh my god! <laughs> you kidding? Uh, now, what the not lead back then. Of Air now. You, looks like. you look like him now. No, he doesn't. He's fucking <laughs> chef from Apocalypse Now. Yeah, I'm a saucier. <laughs> <laughs> so I want to show you. Get his head off. <laughs> never get out of the fucking boat. <laughs> Ah, uh, fucking Kurt's joke. Yeah, yeah, I like fantastic. it. Fantastic. So, uh, so he's, <laughs> that was he's good. A, you combined two people. Oh, that's that's good. That was brilliant. So, Gav used to come over at my place when he first came over to, from England. He would come over and hang out. Like we'd play video games all day. Because I, you know, I had the Xbox You're Live. You're off the interesting part of the story. Of course. Well, he would come over and, and I literally, I'd be like, right. "All right, man, it's time to go." And he'd be like, "All right, mate." Literally. I'd be like, uh, "I gotta go to sleep," and he'd be like, "All right, go ahead, man. I'll, uh, I'm gonna hang out and I'll play video games." Oh yeah, I that. And I'd be in my room playing video games, and he came over for like two weeks straight. He was at my house. <laughs> my girl at the beginning of it was like, "Hey, what's up, Gav?" At the end of it, he was like. Hey, Gav. <laughs> yeah. And then we, we, she, she actually we cooked dinner and we, she cooked a whole pork roast. And we had like, a, well, I had one slice, she had one slice, Gav had one slice. It was so good that uh, Gav goes, are you guys done? Are you finished? And we're like, yeah, that's it. And he just grabbed, stuck his force in the rest of the pork roast and put it on his plate. Not joking. <laughs> ate a, a whole, almost a whole pork roast wow. by himself. Wow. <laughs> and uh, so my girlfriend's girl comes over and... Uh, First of all, uh, don't, don't try to make it sound like you had some little sliver off the fucking piece. <laughs> exactly. I'm sure Jeez. you had a nice exactly. chunk. Exactly. He bought actually bit into it while it was still living. <laughs> <laughs> I, actually, I actually fought Gavin for it. <laughs> 
I took a beating for a pork roast. <laughs> I sucked his cock <laughs> for a pork roast. In the sauna. So, uh, easy. Uh, in the sauna. We worked out together. You suck his cock for a pork rind. <laughs> uh, we're in the sauna, and he takes all his clothes off. And it's like a, it's like a, two, a two-person sauna in my building. And, and he's one and a half. He's a big guy. How tall are you? Six, six, five? Yeah, six. Six five, two hundred and fucking nine thousand pounds, <laughs> and we're in there. I have my shorts on, and uh, I took my shirt off. I, I think I even kept my sneakers and socks on. I just went in just to get a quick steam. Uh, sort of. He comes in, who's going in a steam room with sneakers? Exactly, a sauna. It was a sauna. Okay. I'm sorry. Oh, that's my and uh, he comes in and just <laughs> takes everything off. That's right. That's what you do in saunas. You no, you it. don't. In England, you do. In no, America, in you Europe, don't. You do. In England, you don't either. In yeah. Europe, you just not. Uh, can you get into the English black guy fucking the girls? My cunt? God. <laughs> Really? Exactly. You, forgot, That's to the story. you forgot to mention how much time he had on his Metro card. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> get to the cunt fucking. I like the sauna story. Ruined. That was a unclean cunt Anthony fucking. brought up the. Uh, um, I, I want to hear how it sounded like he was jumping up and down in cherry tomatoes. <laughs> 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 so, so they they meet up and. Uh, <laughs> We all have fun or whatever. We do some horse shit. And then later that night, she's staying at the house. So Gav's, Gav's staying there, too, apparently. And we've never, ha I've never had Holy a friend shit. stave over since I was in like well, fucking high school. How can you stave over? That's not uh, a word. Are you gonna be on everything? What Jesus Christ! What happened, Christ. happened to your storytelling abilities? I'm a little nervous. Jesus, you're running. Get to the fucking exactly. Shut your face. So what happened? She stayed. Shut she's up. Staving Put your hands over. down first right. of all. I don't like it. Why? I'm I just don't like your little thin fingers pointed in my face. <laughs> Anything's thin compared to your face. <laughs> <laughs> that was a fucking softball. So to your head. I don't like it. I don't like that. Thin redwood pointing at me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm with Bob though. We're getting to know what Gavin's all about. Because oh, you know, because you know, this there's, there's, there's something going on with this yeah, guy. Yeah, he's a fucking uncut pork fucking eating monster. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> <what I'm hearing. laughs> How Bob and his girl are kissing, and, and they hear there. he's caving my pussy <laughs> in, being screamed from the living room. But he yeah. keeps going. I think I had Xbox. <laughs> Wait, we playing Grand? Th get the fucking yeah, all right. Gavin <laughs> killing her with his big. Cock. This is like somebody who's like Leon Zabruder talking about. The day Kennedy was shot. Or Abraham like, Zabruder. I, I, I don't know. Oh, Leon Zabruder had a brother Leon. Uh, over did everybody. Did. Jesus yes. Christ. Yes. No, it's like fucking, fucking Abraham Klinghoffer. That pushed <laughs> yeah. off the law. What the fuck are you, a computer? Relax. Let people fuck up and be human. <laughs> Leon fucking Zabruder. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, he shot Pete Kennedy in the head. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> 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 I'm trying to stick up for you. Harley Osmond shot. Norton's on fire. Ruby Red Grape. What about this? What about uh, I don't want to go forward. Oh, what the fuck? You're pushing me into the fucking line of fire. Let's go. Let's go. Nothing good's going to happen. Uh, this is taking way too long. To get to the meat. Oh, I know. So, get so, so get to the devastation. Of the Let me just take oh, a breath on. so I make sure right. I say things well, correctly. Hey, Larry so CK, fucking no net won't fucking grab me. Go ahead. Go ahead, right. fucking. All right. Story. All right. Uh, hey, so, uh, so we come back to the house, and uh, they're on the. We go in the. We're like, you know, it comes to that point where it's like, okay, uh, Gav is gonna either gonna go home or, you know, we're going to bed. Okay, we'll see you guys later. And they're on the couch still. So we go in the bedroom. We're lying there. I got the two dogs. The dogs were scared. <laughs> Kelby, fucking Kelby dog was, was licking my feet. Uh, uh, <laughs> he was he was, he, it smelled like fucking roast beef. <laughs> he was just licking blood oh, off the couch. <laughs> <laughs> so we're in the bed, and oh, you just you hear the kid that 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 the first kissing that. Uh, <laughs> you fucking, you fucking, uh, you fucking, you fucking. And then I'll, you, you, then you just hear fucking. The couch just <laughs> like it was wood. You didn't hear it wasn't even metal. He was actually getting into the wood of the couch. Like you know, you hear the sw the springs in the couch. Yeah, you hear the wood just going <laughs> like a ship, like a ship in heavy sea. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, it was the black pearl. <laughs> but he, but she, uh, just to let you know, this girl weighs probably 85 pounds. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, yeah. she looked like she had AIDS. 
<laughs> like that's how thin she was. She was a thin, thin girl. And this fucking monster. Just under 300. Oh, just plowing her. Being her chiropractor. (laughs) (laughs) He did the equivalent of kicking her cunt in with a metal boot. (laughs) The equivalent. (laughs) But she actually told Dawn, my girl actually said to me, the reason why I know she was on the period, because I was like, do you think they're going to, we're in the room, like, do you think they're going to fuck? And she's like, no, she's on the period. She said she wasn't going to do anything. But this fucking monster just plucked that Uh. tampon out like a fucking, a pear off a tree. (laughs) Threw it against my wall. He made tea for count, count. (laughs) (laughs) Straight out of scoliosis. Oh, God. That's nice. Took the curl out of her fallopian tube. (laughs) (laughs) He he smoothed out all the bumpy parts of her pussy. (laughs) Oh, what the hell was that? I'll tell you what it was. (laughs) Oh. It's all right. Uh, all right, there you go. And then, uh, well, hold on. So you, you guys, and know. then he, he just left her. Your friend is fucking <laughs> just Dawn's left friend. Her. Yeah, you left. Of course, I just left. What do you do? Kiss and cuddle and fucking. Then you, then you went to Boston and fucked her one more time, yeah, didn't you? Did you? Uh-huh. Good, but she fell fuck. in love with she him. Great. She was in love. Gavin really? was Really? She likes the cock, huh? Fuck, you know? Well, yeah. she usually dates uh, gangster American black guys, <laughs> which are totally different than this fucking swamp oh, yeah, English totally. douche. <laughs> you know, I was using all yeah. kinds of slang. And... Bad. This is the uh, lethal. Oh, this he's, is... he's black, yep. but he's really light-skinned. <laughs> right. And with the accent. And he's got an accent. Right. And he's re- he's made of pure... He's pure animal. He's like a tiger. He's like that tiger that killed a kid in San Diego. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> like, you know there's a woman... Fucking masturbating to that in, in the, <laughs> in the, in the, the food watch. court. <laughs> oh, a little smooth accent. So we are uh, Tracy. Uh, 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 uh. I'm black, but it's all right. Listen yeah, to it's me. All right. <laughs> I like white girls too. Yeah. You know. Next thing you know, he's fucking her with his fucking hand over her face, like Chief <laughs> when he's killing <laughs> Nelson. <laughs> yeah, she was pretty. She was weird, wasn't she? Uh, well, yeah. She, you know, she actually. I'll tell yeah. you. Ba- she actually. Uh, Hooked up with this guy, uh, black Crazy dude. thing is, this woman, this woman exists. She's out somewhere. And we're <laughs> she's telling this story <laughs> about her. Uh, well, this she... is a few years ago now. It's going back a few years. Oh, okay. It's not recently. She's got a whole other life now. Yeah, yeah. she's moved yeah. on. Well, she moved she's on to another me. black guy who was actually turned out to be a pimp and <laughs> threw in a trunk and locked her in there and drove around the city <laughs> for like four hours. True. Oh, yeah, a trunk. A hey, look, you she fucking did? pick up a yeah. scorpion. You're going to get bit. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to break. Get into some smoothies. He said, because I'm an alligator. <laughs> <laughs> uh, story right. tells a lot. Get us out of here for a bit. I know I speak like an idiot. Do you? It's all about me. Is it? I, I was assaulted. Were you? We're brilliant broadcasters. Are we? You are out of your mind. Am I? That sounds real good. Does it? I'm thrilled. I'm excited. Am I? I thought I heard Negro. Did you? It's the OB and Anthony Show. Is it? It's the Opie and Anthony show. A very busy Opie and Anthony show today. I guess. Anthony's getting ready for his big weekend. That's right, damn it. On the private jet to Mohegan now, Sun. Swing on over to Mohegan Sun and gamble with the engines. It's going to be great. <laughs> yep. Oh, yeah, I ran into a guy last night who... Uh, you're going with what's his name that works here? Sometimes? Keith, the guy is that his name? Yeah, looks kind of like Otto Peterson a little Keith bit. The cop, <laughs> wow, good call, doesn't he? he does. <laughs> yeah, yes. a little bit. Otto, if he had said no back in like 1974, right. to that first line that was yeah. offered to him, exactly, long way to go for nothing. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't sure. I was I was at the uh, olive tree with my uh, I was with my daughter, my two year old, and he walked up with another co- with a uniform cop. Yeah, and I wasn't exactly sure. Like, I've seen him on the tour mostly. I don't uh-huh. know him that well. And he went, hey, what's up? And when I'm with my daughter, I really want people to stay the fuck away from me. Like, I'm very protective. <laughs> right. You just have a different 
So he's like, hey, and he's like going to her, hey. I'm like, get the fuck. Like, I think I, I might have been shitty to him. I hope I wasn't. <laughs> he's, a, but, he's an NYPD lieutenant. Yeah. I think he's okay. <laughs> no, I, well, I know, but cops run amongst filth, you know, like that's Well, their, that's true. You know, they put it in jail, but still, you don't want <laughs> them to touch your daughter after wow. fucking a dirty fucking <laughs> tranny yeah. finger. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> after fucking, you got a point there. Pushing <laughs> some crackhead's head down into a cruiser. <laughs> yeah. And now that a hand is, on his hand. Yeah. And, Oh, yeah. Now he's Pat touching your little my kid's head. Yeah, exactly. Give her head a tussle or hair. Huh? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, Fucking. he's going. Uh, him and his wife, uh, me, uh, my girl, and um, my mother, and Sal. Sal's just been calling every day. He's excited. So huh? we're going. It's almost Friday, Anthony. This is going to be a lot of fun. So what? You got a sweets and the plane and the limo? It's from Baltimore. So it's Baltimore? just like, oh, <laughs> row, row. We're going to go row. Pack. What kind of clothes am I going to need? He's like asking me things. I go, I don't know. Just bring some, <laughs> bring a, gambling he's clothes. Excited, he's so excited. He's like a little kid. Take care of him. He's a good man. We're going on a plane. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, so Private we're jet back and forth. We're doing that. They hooked us up with, uh, yeah. You'll have some stories on Monday. And, um, if you're here on Monday. I went to the <laughs> I went to the safety deposit box. Got had to go to the box. Off. Yeah. I was, in there a I was in there a while. What are you keeping your box? And your safety deposit to keep cash. But isn't that isn't that stupid? <laughs> no. No. I mean, isn't that not collecting interest or something? Yeah, but it it's uh it's a different account that I have. <laughs> it's a, called a collect either a lot of interest by winning. <laughs> or really losing a lot of it. It's my gambling money. Oh, okay. So you just want fast access. I just, poof, yeah, yeah. Right. I, I, I like uh, being able to keep tabs on my win-loss record. Okay. So it all goes in the box. And right. then when I go, I take it out of the box. And hopefully when I go home, oh. I get to put some back into the box. Or well, two boxes. And that's how it goes. Oh, you are two boxes. <laughs> well, I would love to have to ask for a bigger box. box. How much is in that box at, at a given time? Um, well, wow. we'd have to shut the mics off again. But oh. isn't it stupid? <laughs> but isn't it, isn't, uh, hold it, on, hold isn't it dumb to have cash? Doesn't cash just sit there Wait. and not collect? Hold on, he'll explain everything. Yeah, we'll turn off all the mics. I guess. I I know, you know, actually, that stuff financially makes a lot of sense. <laughs> <laughs> I love how, I love that's how this, sound thinking. <laughs> the story always like ends up like that, where it's like we go away, you turn everybody around. There's a around. complete it's, lack it's of amazing. understanding that's before amazing. the mics are on, and then when the mics come back on, it's like, oh Jesus Christ, of course. Oh, yeah. You'd be Revelation. a great, you'd yeah, be a great <laughs> well, What kind of shitty advice wow. is that from Louis anyway? He's gambling. Yeah. Why don't you buy treasury bonds? Fucking <laughs> 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 goody two shoes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm buying a lot of nothing chips. in the bank anywhere. So <laughs> I'm buying a lot of chips. What are you I'm hoping to bring back more chips <laughs> yeah, <laughs> to the window. Yeah. And uh yeah, that's uh, that's this weekend. What so. are you playing? Blackjack or the three card poker? Blackjack. But three card poker oh. is kinda of fun to fuck around with and stuff, but if you're serious mm. in, in wanting to get in there and maybe do some damage uh either way, <laughs> blackjack's the game. When are you coming back? Sunday. Okay. Do you have your own table, or you just play with other players? Oh, it, a host, my okay. own, table. own table. But I, I have played with other people. Um, if they're good, it's fine. Yep. If you know, you don't want to play with the frail, smoking Asian gentleman that doesn't know when to hit or, or yeah. stay. Uh, that's a little annoying. Yeah. Um, but you know, you play in the high roller section, and they all know what they're doing, so okay. you don't have to worry about it. And it's it's. So is it better okay. to play on your own, or better to play with other players? Uh, it's better to play with other players. I found when you just you and the dealer, it goes a little too fast. Yeah, that's okay. the problem. It goes a little too fast. Yeah. Well, what's I, the and I, I, the thing I don't is like the, the automatic same shuffler. Game. I like when they have to stop. Shuffle right. the shoe. I, I like taking a little breather. It does like show that. you how much of it is in your brain, though. How much yeah. of it is like when you play roulette. 
and there's a yep. whole table full of people, you feel pretty good. But when it's just you're just one asshole, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's just like you've just got these you're two the lonely fucking, chips. You're the lone zebra numbers. at the watering hole, and the, yeah, and the <laughs> fucking ball falls like ten miles away from where you were, <laughs> and you realize how dumb. That's when you realize how dumb roulette is. Yeah, when there's like every number has a chip on it. You're like, yeah, hey, yeah. one of us is because gonna... it's like because every time someone's like, yeah, yeah I yeah. won. You're like, hey, that could be me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and then when you're, you're like alone, on two like, red and. You realize how many numbers you can't cover? <laughs> yeah, that's impossible. How is the longest you've ever played? Oh, <laughs> my God. 20, probably Sober. 20 hours. Sober? Sober? Yeah. Eight minutes. <laughs> <laughs> As long as it took for the first drink to arrive. It's a, yeah, yeah. Usually, yeah. When, when I sit down, um, uh, the first thing I'll do is order a drink. Sure. Yes. And, yeah. and, but you got You really do have to be careful, though. Because you can't get too fucked up. They'll yeah. try to feed you drink. You got to be sure. able to think reasonably. But it helped one time. Uh, <laughs> it, it ended up. It was somewhere around six in the morning. Uh, Keith, the cop, was sitting there. Uh, I was getting pretty like hammered, but I was way up, and I was kind of oh, nice sound effect. Hmm. Wow, <laughs> Tom would love this. Sure. Uh, yeah. But I was they getting like too tired. I would have stayed there, <laughs> uh, and I was up. But I was like, you know something? I'm just too fucking tired to <laughs> continue. Yeah. So I walked away with the chips and walked away ahead. Yeah. But I would have stayed there yeah. until you know. Oh, the pile went down a little. Should I leave? No. Yeah. Stay until you win that back. No, your body which is the has more smoke. financial sense than your brain. Yeah, does. exactly. Yeah. 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 Kenny Rogers said it best. Um, that's what? right. Come in my beard. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Gatlin boys, go fuck Becky. <laughs> 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 Yeah, I'm in my <laughs> <laughs> that's I like famous the famous right? <laughs> I feel like I'm there. That's the line from his famous song. <laughs> it really is, yes. Yeah. The cum goes <laughs> love the county. <laughs> that's it's a B-side. Side. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Yeah. We know he's the coward, he's right? crying on his fucking daddy's it picture. Sucks. Hey, Sissy. Where's Danny? Get... We gotta get the Bob Kelly puking audio on. Oh my god, yes. Yeah. We've been teasing this for a few days, but uh, Danny's saying this is the best puking you've had yet um it's from your saturday night virus show right saturday night well, this puke girl show. was explaining <laughs> oh i followed this shit didn't i you mean when on one of the virus oh no from your saturday i thought, no, no, no. I thought you meant from the virus tour no, no i just no. remember him puking on stage and then and now now me <laughs> <laughs> that <was> good <laughs> fucking slipped in his uh, puke the girl <laughs> the girl was talking about uh, we were talking about yeast infections mm. and they were actually hot just in depth going into what he Yeast. I, I always thought Jimmy explained to me a yeast infection is that milky, yeah, white stuff. The milky milky Elmer's glue. But yeah. apparently, it can turn lumpy, mm -hmm. <laughs> like cottage <it's> cheese. <laughs> yeah. And then they actually to uh, so they use a suppository to to help, and you have to put that in. But that actually creates a Jesus. another mixture, mm -hmm. almost like a wow. You're making a white Russian in there. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> like a, how long does a yeast infection have to go for before it hits these different stages? Six months. Wow. <laughs> then she fucking, it's like baking a fucking cake. They, they pull Six a Pepperidge farm box out of her country. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a Dutch oven. <laughs> we got Danny in studio. Danny? Uh, well, now, by saying it was the best one ever, I just want to just preface this by saying it's not the best audio of Bob puking ever, yeah, but it was definitely his best puke as far as volume and consistency. Oh, wow. Oh, you actually... It came out projectile, but it, 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 because something hit me because I have a something happened to me a long time ago when I was uh, when I used to drink and party and shit when I was younger. Me and my friends would all get get trashed and fucked this woman, this retarded woman named oh. Connie. Oh, oh, God. 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 Let me just jump in and go. You don't say woman like retarded woman. <laughs> Like that's a casual. I don't know. Aside. She, <laughs> I don't know if she was retarded more than she might have been mentally ill. More than yeah, retarded. It wasn't like right. she was going, oh, I like mm. talk. It was more, she would repeat herself like, yeah, 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 come on in. Yeah, 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 yeah. But she was, she was around 35. Get the papers, worse. get the papers. <laughs> get the papers, get the papers. Uh, Wapner. Wapner's on at five. Uh, so. <laughs> <laughs> So we're 
We're on a bus. We're on an abandoned school bus. She was retarded bus. enough not to wash her pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently so. <laughs> Where I think the story's going. We were on a, a, a. We all got stoned. We met her on a, a this abandoned school bus in a in an alley or something. <laughs> <laughs> How old is your bubby? This sounds like a rape, by yeah, the way. Of course. <laughs> that was another day. Christ. <laughs> But uh, there was around four of us, or five of us, and uh, you just happened upon some woman who hangs out in the, yeah, bus. the door open. Empty bus. I got nervous; it was the fucking cops. Yeah. Well, um. So I was the last one in. <laughs> oh, fuck. oh my god! Oh, oh no. my god! You fucking cream pie, didn't you, <laughs> sissy boy? You cream. You fucking. You're a, you're a buddy cuckold. He laid on the back of the bus, and she <laughs> fucking squatted low oh, into his mouth. No. Jesus, please. Please. No, a Boston, Boston cream not. pie. Jesus. That's what you <laughs> know. No, it's not your fantasy, boy. Relax. Oh. What you did, it, did it just all squish out the <laughs> yeah. side? No, no, no. no. no his no, mouth no. looked like a fucking cappuccino. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. With the brown part, too. Oh. <laughs> not just the white foam, but the brown flex. Oh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> that's, that's, that's just disgusting, Bob. Yeah, well. Yeah. All right. <laughs> fucking a crack addict on my Bob fucking saw that bloody pussy. Said, fucking, I'm going in anyway. <laughs> no, I didn't. I was too young. To, I was, uh, I think I was 14. I was too young. Oh, I didn't God, know anything damn about pussy. It. And you were 14? I was wow. doing it like because. Oh, God. I was doing it because, uh, you know, hey, dude, you go fucking. I didn't know how to fuck, really, what I was doing. Uh, or what it was all about. I knew I had to just go. Now you know how to fuck a retarded girl's frothy Absolutely. Pussy. <laughs> now you know how to I'm man it up. Yeah. Well, first of all, you'd be number Back one then. or two. You're not number five. You're no, number five. No. Um, and she, uh... Ugh. Why are you paranoid every time know. someone walks he in? He walks behind me and he's got a lot of wind with him. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> Fucking wide asshole. Um, so, uh, I went over there and her, I guess... Now I understand. I never, I, I never understood it all these years. But now I guess her pussy. I guess she might have cu came. No, that and was how no. when women. No, it was other uh, she did. Come. Well, well no, what happened idea. is that she came. I think she came and she discharged. No, she had an infection. Uh, whatever it was, and and, and, and it shot out. What? Is she a squirt? It shot out like, dude, not squirting. It didn't squirt. Squirt is too cute for what happened. <laughs> <laughs> it gushed. Uh, gushed. Gushed is a word I use. Gushed. Gushed. Uh, shot. Okay. No, what happened was uh, that she started peeing, and the pee pushed <laughs> all the four guys' thumb out. <laughs> That's right. It was. And then she later had the bastard's child <laughs> and oh, five it, disgusting it losers <laughs> from Boston. <laughs> Oh. In the back of a bus, so fucking... it came out like cum oatmeal. Oh god! Oh, god. <laughs> oh, god. Yes. How about that smell? Uh. It did, I, I don't remember the smell at all. I just remember that it, it got in my pubes. Oh, oh god. God. damn it! Shit. To hell, yeah. dude! It was like somebody Jesus. threw oatmeal on your box. Uh. Uh. Look at, hey. the, look at the girl's face out there. She is so... You're, uh. You are so disgusted. Are you going to say aristocrats at the end of this? <laughs> <laughs> this fucking disgusting. Yeah. One of the listeners out there never in the anything like this. Finally. Finally. Oh, it's disgusting. Oh, my friends all laughed, though. They yeah. were like, ah, oh, look oh, at sure. you cock. Yeah, I didn't see it. What was she saying bus? or oh, doing? Or was she crying or sleeping? Or what was her? She was. I think she was saying. Uh, was she telling jokes? Was she putting she, fruit? She, in her she was counting. Ma she was counting <laughs> counting matchsticks on the floor. Oh, it's three sixty seven. Three sixty seven. It's three hundred sixty seven. What's oh, that matches? Uh, she. Uh, she. Uh, yeah. She just. Sh I mean, literally. I think she actually made a move. I remember her making a move with her pelvis and her back, and it just shot. Oh, just gushed so out. You vomited. Yeah, it was a squirter. Yeah, I, I just, I didn't know. I thought it was egg. I didn't know what happened. Oh, oh, she, God, I didn't know what happened. I just didn't know <laughs> what happened. Fucking caviar shot out of her. No, fucking <laughs> cracker. It was fucking a hen. <laughs> Did it smell? Did it trout smell? eggs oh. shot out of her. Cunt. <laughs> That's horrible. That's hilarious. Man. That's hilarious. It was. I didn't know what it was. Oh, though. I didn't understand. God. I didn't know what about a fucking. Did you taste vagina. it? Did you taste it, Bob? Uh, you gotta get mind your dirty fucking <laughs> piece of it. Did taste it? We taste it in Britain. <laughs> Fuck off. We should, have, we should have pulled it out of your pubes and sniffed uh, it. Uh, and then yeah. tip your tongue. Uh, and then just, just between your two teeth, just kind of nibble uh, on it. Yeah. Uh, nibble. Uh, nibble. Uh, look at, so wait a minute. So yeah, she I know shot... it. You guys are trying to get me to puke. I get it. I get it. I get fucking stupid she afro shot... heads in here with the camera. <laughs> you nervous. He has so, a hard time holding minute, that heavy camera up. What? So she shot cunt tapioca into your balls. <laughs> yes. That's a good one. That's... that's and then what did you I'd do? say more rice pudding. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 that tapioca is too smooth. It was clumpy. Yeah. But the... It, 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 
And then when she shut up, I, she she actually got nervous, like she did a bad thing, like she did she, it before, oh, why and her she father nervous? beat her for it. <laughs> oh. Why did she get ill at pussy ease? Clunk, clumps on my rug. Oh, that made her ill at ease? That's weird. She must be very insecure. <laughs> mm. <laughs> yeah, I guess. A little uncomfortable after that. So what's this audio? I really couldn't eat. Oh. Anything like for a long time after that, yeah. it would have affected my view. Certainly visual. made up for it. <laughs> All right, well, no. <laughs> that was a lot funnier. That was a lot funnier than the response it got. That's oh, all I was yeah. yeah. I didn't hear it. I think what it was his saying? excited delivery. I know. You sure made up for that one. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> he said I wasn't so wait, able to eat anything for the longest time. We and then got it. You sure made up for that one. Because he's fat. It's going to fucking punch up his joke, make it better. Because he's a fat. So <laughs> it's true. He eats a lot. Uh, so eat. then we get to Danny. Yeah. So this girl was well. Exp well first of all, the girls so were all talking this was about starting to conjure in your mind. You're we making talking, an association to that evening. What we were talking about, we were talking about pussy, and it started with a yeast infection. Yeah. Then it, this girl, I think, went into how she had a yeast infection and got cheesecloth and put garlic in it and put it in her vagina because someone what? told her that. Yeah, the, the girl, Marla Schultz, I had on the show, she put garlic Ooh. in her pussy <laughs> yeah. to cure a yeast infection. <laughs> sure, yeah. And forgot bullet. about it. <laughs> by, the way, by the way, they dumped out a spick on the other side of the show. I <laughs> yeah. just want to bring that <laughs> yeah, to everyone. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And pissed away. <laughs> yeah, yeah, pissed away. Yeah. Yeah. Just so you can understand the world we live in. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's a pride dumped God. over there, too. Yeah. Yeah. They dumped out faggot and spick. Yeah. And over here, we're talking about tapioca cunt. I think it would get dumped out. Too, all right, so let's play the audio. So that was all in your head when, when this girl called your show, right? Put yeah. cheesecloth in her box. All right, let's listen to this. Have you had a yeast infection? Yes, I think every girl has had a yeast infection. Well, what happens? Does your pussy expire? No, it doesn't expire. <laughs> it's like, you know, some, st you know, some stinky cock probably gave you a little, yeah, you probably got a, something from the guy, because guys have yeast infections, too. Mm -hmm. And then what happens is it just, like, you know, no, cultivates, we, no, we and don't. it's, like, thick, <laughs> and it can be, like, kind of... Gross, you what know. What do you mean thick? Like a milkshake? No, like cottage cheese. Yeah, Kathy. they call it the cottage cheese disease. Really? Yeah. Because yeah. if you pee, you look in the in the toilet, and there's like little oh. pieces of cottage <laughs> cheese. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's the dish. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's true, though. Oh my God, he's gonna throw up. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Oh. Me this. It's just discharge. You fucking you discharge South Beach diet out of your cunt. <laughs> what? Yeah, that's, the that's fuck? how you know you have a yeast infection. Besides the smell, you sh you, you besides put the smell, cottage get... cheese comes out of your vagina. Call it the cottage cheese disease. Does it make a plop sound when it goes in? It's not that no. thick. It's just little pieces, little yeah. chunks. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, know, I it's like when you boil chunk. out raviolis for too long. <laughs> <laughs> My God, Louis, you can't. What happens? Nothing. Your vagina. What do you do for it? Do you, uh, you, you gotta take medicine. Monistat. What is it? Monistat. Monistat. So you gotta go to CVS and buy Monistat. Yeah, and yeah. that's all you need. That's, that's just a depository. Uh, and you put it in your vagina. Stick it in there. And, and then what done. happens? And then you actually, you actually, it's worse oh. than it's worse because then a lot of stuff comes out. Like what? Because like, you'll be hot as cheese in the Monistat. Wait yeah. a minute. All sorts coming out. <laughs> it, it's, like if you're. Oh my, oh my God. God. God! You really oh threw up. God. Oh my God. Holy oh my shit. God. That was a lot oh of puke, Bobby. God. Holy you really shit. Puke? Oh. All right, listen. Oh. 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 Danny, Danny, that take us to break. Take us to break. No. And we're back live. Uh, and Louie, I noticed, as he's yeah, listening, he's looking at the head. Kills it a puking? It's, I can't right now right into my ears like that. Why? Through headphones. It's just, a, I don't know. It makes It unsettles my stomach to hear puking like that. Ew. Not a lot, but you know, I'm not usually squeamish. I can look at bloody things and stuff like that. And, cool. You know, yeah, no problem. Shit and puke upsets me a little bit. Puke is bad, though. Yeah, pu Shit, puke, and other people's cum. <laughs> 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 Error in judgment, by the way. Imagine that, Lil. <laughs> See, that's kind of cartoony. I don't mind that. That's uh, that's all right. That's that real, sounds though. funny, but silly. That's real. <laughs> yeah, but that Jesus. sounds okay. Pass from Monarchy, right? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, oh, that's a little. That's, yeah. that's, that's it. Right it. The last one. It was, Where there's no heat, <laughs> yeah, there's just water. Oh. Did you ever see the Sergeant McGoo video? You know, you guys? <laughs> oh, that's <all> all right. <laughs> oh, Jesus! <laughs> that's a lot of puke. Yeah, man. that's bad. Uh, I don't know. Let me see what this one sounds like. 
God. All right, how about this one? That's a good one. It's a dry heave, and then you hear a little stuff. I can't, the thing is, it's also, I have a huge aversion to puke. Like, I can't. I I hate puking. It oh, hurts. yeah, yeah. It, I find it so painful and upsetting. Yeah. Like, when I have food poisoning or something, you know, if you feel food poisoning, if you puke, it's over the instant yep. you puke. I will hold it in. Ride and it let, out. <laughs> let the poison course through my veins, my whole body, <laughs> and I will host that poison yeah. for, like, 48 hours rather than puke. Yeah. And I'll just sit there shivering. Run a temperature up to like 115. <laughs> <laughs> and fucking see my, my How do you have a choice, feet though, are turning yellow. Doesn't it just make I you hold puke? it down. I hold There's it down. a way. I think some people have a more like an easy switch to anti gesticulate. I think it's just it's fucking puke. I can't, yeah, but for me, puking like my body just it it puts I'm me through a lot down of pain. The throat puke. Like, no. I've like, never been able to oh do that God. in my life. Nope. Nope. Never in my life been no. able to do I'm that. Right the same way. I, I cry puking. and scream when I'm puking. I literally like go. Oh, no, I don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> I have a huge problem. It is with weird. It. No one likes it. Oh, it's just but there are people puke. that can just go. Bleh, I'm done. I think it's something about how your body's made, like the, the, your pipes <clears throat> work yeah. a certain way. Some I, people hey, don't yeah. go in a reverse nicely. I gotta ask Louie, Have I, you seen Two Girls One Cup? Oh, that's a good one. That's two just girls, silly. One cup? Yeah. yeah, it's no, silly. It's oh, just two girls, silly. silly. That, that, turn around. Put on all the TVs. Just turn I want to see it. Hold oh, on. Yeah. All the TVs. This is just a little les lesbo uh, <laughs> clip. Silly. It's just silly, Louis. It's a fucking... I don't even think they're hot to make it out. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't think it's got its own website. This one clip has its own yeah. website. Yeah. It's just yeah. silly. Well, it's because they're fucking making out. It's silly. Hold on. We're putting it on all the TVs. All right. Just in case you turn this way, you can still see it. Yeah. Here we go. All right. Just take a look. Please don't look away. Okay. Why would he? Unless he wants to jerk off. <laughs> <laughs> it's about a minute. What are they, Brazilian See? girls? Yeah. Okay, Lesbian nice girl. action. Nice, right? Warm white girl. girl, white girl. Oh, oh my Jesus God. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> That's just wrong. Isn't it? Pause it. Pause it. Pause it. Pause it. Pause it. Wait a minute. Dirty bitch. Louie. <laughs> oh, you dirty <laughs> bitch. <laughs> I like Gavin's oh, reaction. Oh, Gavin, you dirty Gavin, bitch. Oh. Gavin's cock is hot oh, right now. I'm oh, I'm you switching. cheeky bitch. <laughs> yeah. oh, Bobby's not, not okay. looking. Bobby's not looking. Bobby. Like that's I Bobby. 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 Come on, Bobby. 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 I can't even look what's on the screen now. That's not okay. I just had a Jamba Juice. I was like... Oh, the pink version of the same thing. Well, wait, How not. could you not watch the most famous oh, clip on the internet that was, right that, now? That twirled she, like soft serve. Like it that came out. In. Yeah. <laughs> it was amazing how cup. quickly the cup filled. The best part, this is the part, Bobby, you guys see. Right after she shits. Yeah, oh, pause this for a minute. Okay. Watch the asshole because it goes <laughs> yeah. like this. <laughs> it gives it, the asshole gives a kiss, and the shit stickiness, yeah, which connects the shit. It's like shit string. There's two string. Watch. Strange. watch. That is stinky poo. Watch, wait. Watch the last Hold part. On. And uh, you yeah, see look the little string. Yeah, it's like Bobby, look. Sure. Bobby, look. No, I'm not puking. Uh, Bobby, you're you're puking. Puking. No, no, I'm not your fucking <laughs> dumb fan. I was puke. the same way no, about this clip when I first else. saw it. You pretended something else. And now I can watch it like no problem. I'm not fucking losing electrolytes for you. But don't you think that you... Somewhere you paid a price for the immunization? Yes. My sensitivity... Now, Louie, try to get to the end of the clip, please. Wow, look at that. Please. Okay, go ahead. It's a nice speech. We've all done it. We've all made it to the end. I'm pretending... It's something oh, else. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All right. Oh, that's her shit, you fuck. Oh, oh, God. Look at that. She's oh. having fun with it. Oh. I see. Roll in her, her mouth. She's sucking. Look how brown her tongue is. Roll that around in your mouth. Hey, hey, Louie. Her fucking tongue oh, is, dude, her tongue is not... coffee, co coffee oh. ice cream. I got, nothing to, I got nothing to gain by watching that. <laughs> I'm doing nice fat heart on that myself. <laughs> <laughs> what do you eat to get shit like that? <laughs> yeah, that's the other thing. Is that woman? Yeah. Are you going to go shopping? She eats it now. That girl eats a McDonald's too much. And what do you eat to get shit like that? Someone else's shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, that's like fifth generation is it more, shit. Is it, is it more, <laughs> this is like her shit yeah, yeah. after eating her shit. If you kept doing that. She's environmentally conscious. She yeah. only recycles other shit. If you shit. kept doing that just to keep... Somebody shits in your mouth, and then you shit in someone yeah. else's mouth. Eventually, a diamond comes out. 
That must be sad. The cure for cancer. Uh, what if that turned out to be the cure for cancer? That people have to, uh, like, 15 times shit in each other's mouths. Norton would Stop never get cancer. cancer. No, I'd be a fucking cancer-free boy. Stop right, stalling. Right, here we go. Almost what what happens next? Call, uh, she's a I just got in between her right. teeth. That's uh, great, yeah. Oh, she's Save, smiling. And she doesn't get Oh! No way! You dirty fucking bitch! French kiss him if shit? Yes. Yeah, the, yeah, now the well, girls are making out. Uh, the thing that's upsetting about it is how... <laughs> <laughs> we only got, the thing breath? that's upsetting about it is the looks on their faces because they don't care. <laughs> <laughs> they don't yeah. care. They are so fucking nonchalant about this. Oh, oh God. You know that's what that right. room I must smell like? Oh, oh my God. God. The whole room. <laughs> oh, God. I just feel bad. It's not a big mystery. Oh. <laughs> it's, it's oh, right. Right. I doubt it's water? perfume or financial water. success. It smells like a pediatric <laughs> ward. I, I watched it again because I'm like, oh, how much worse is How much worse can it get? <laughs> she shit it into an so ice cream cone. Oh, yeah. They both ate it. And then the other one's uh, showing it off in her mouth. Okay, I'll watch How much worse? Can it get? Oh. It's a lot worse. All right, well, well you better, let's take you a look. look at the screen. Let's we're, see we're how, how it's worse. It's yeah. like they're making out with huh. fucking what? cookie dough in their mouth. <laughs> <laughs> how much did I get fucking paid for Probably this? Probably not a lot. Brazil, man. Perfume, Perfume and I'll finance. I'm tomorrow. It's amazing. <laughs> All right. <laughs> fucking Jimmy, man. Yeah, yeah Lloyd. Uh, see, uh, this is what the Writers Guild is fighting for, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> that these girls should be getting paid for us watching this. This should be the next one. Here we go. Yeah, someone had to write this, right? Here we go. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, uh, so, no, watch no you have it. to. Yeah, I'm oh. looking there. I'm looking there. Right, okay, look, look over, over there. there. Oh, oh my <laughs> God! Louie! <laughs> <laughs> We're never going to get to the end the of this. The one girl is puking shit onto the other cup oh. of shit. Yes. <laughs> what do you expect to do with it? <laughs> uh, Gavin's going to puke. Gavin's going to puke. Oh, shit. Gavin's going to puke. Here, get my fucking oh, Don't get my fucking Don't get my fucking Don't get my fucking Don't get my fucking belt. Oh, shit. I'm not laughing at puking the same time. Oh, oh, he's gonna get to the mic. <laughs> he puked on the mic. He puked on the mic. <laughs> now Louis is leaving. Louis is leaving the studio. <laughs> Louis just walked out. <laughs> oh, the show's a catastrophe. <laughs> We just knocked out the 6'5", 290-pound English oh, leg. Holy He's shit. out. He's tapping out. Holy what is shit. Going on? <laughs> I need some water, man. You need water. Oh, that is the worst film of my fucking life. Sam, where's your camera? Oh, oh God. Okay, what are you not filming? I didn't miss that. Oh, oh, no, 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 we're not done yet. We're almost sorry. done. Wow. We're almost done. This clip's oh, on. Wait, no, the clip, I'm not done. Fucking. No, this clip's no, only, no, the no, clip's no, only no, 45 exactly. seconds. I don't care. It doesn't help me. Come on. This is like heroin. Put on my table. Where's Bobby? After a while, you'll be turning people onto this. You'll be going, dude, you see you see this? It's like you're hanging out with the cast of Waiting to Exhale. You fucking man up and watch it. There's no reason. I don't get Oh, to watch it. It doesn't that, help the country. Shit. That last like, part took out nothing, three guys. It's it's amazing. Not, it's no Socially redeeming value. National security. Oh. Yes, the Bob Kelly Live Club all bailed out on that oh. fucking puke. No. You never seen anybody puke on a cup of shit before? <laughs> <laughs> shelter. You're it's shelter. Look, blue. enjoy it. But if I, <laughs> if I watch it, an angel doesn't get its Man, wings. Because <laughs> I watched some cunt puke uh, another cunt uh, shit. Can we get some water for Gavin, please? We have to finish this clip. Gavin will at least get to the end. Uh, we're, almost the we're almost there. We're almost there. Just Hold don't on. drink coffee if you watch this, anybody. I think we got the grand finale coming up. <laughs> the grand finale. Yeah, Where's yeah, fucking Bobby? Yeah. Where's the bin? I'm Where's Bobby? Bobby? Bobby snuck out. He's he's done. Yes, Is he coming? <laughs> oh, Bobby's over there. Okay, okay. Bobby, talk on Mike. What happened? Oh, Bob. Bob's in the other studio. Bob. At least say what happened. How could Bobby scare us with being sick? He's a fucking. Uh, that, oh look man. At that. She's just. Thanks, buddy. Wow. <laughs> salt I like her mouth that right there. started a chain effect we didn't want. <laughs> yeah. That scene is the, that's the bad scene right there, I guess. Huh? Right, come oh. on, guy. Let's fucking man up and finish. Yeah, man up. Let's all okay. man up. Let's man up. Let's I'm let's man up. Here we go. Man up. Here we go. Come on. Rally. Here we go. Rally time. Come all right. on. Oh, come, come on. on. Pull it together, everybody. All right. Why don't we go back a little bit? Because they. Yeah, that's what you want to do. <laughs> they you want to this. this bit. Just a little. Okay. So that's that's scene. Bit, yeah. yeah, but you've seen this already. Yeah, she, look, look no at the problem. way this shit's between her teeth. Isn't All right, that wonderful? Man, All right, come on. I'm she's done gonna, looking. She's going to need a good flossing. <laughs> <I'm done. laughs> With a tampon strength. Right? <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. 
Come on, let's all rally. It's Friday. Oh, <laughs> Heading toward the weekend. Hit Here play, we go. Thanikins. Here we come go. Come on, Lou. You can come on, do Lou. It. Man up. Lou, he's all closing the eye already. Come on, Lou. All, all right. the guys are laughing. We saw that. Uh, it was the main thing. It's all getting better. The French kiss with the no, shit. Don't That's like that part. Just oh, no, she pukes in the fucking theater. Oh, he eats it. Blurbs it up. And then no! <laughs> a nice <laughs> shit puke right in the mouth. What the fuck? Uh, what? And a close up. Louis <laughs> 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 out. What the He's throwing the headphones down. He's done. <laughs> he is out. He's kicking furniture over. He's kicking the furniture over. He's had it. Don't wreck our studio. He's had it. I love it. Oh, he's not happy. Oh. I've learned something about Louie today. He, that clip made him angry. Oh, did he get angry? Gavin, you all right? <laughs> I can't. I can't unwatch that. <laughs> yeah. I can't unwatch that. Right, Louis, Louis on mic way over that's there. That's in my memory. Oh, yeah. That's, yeah. Unwatch. Watch your head. Uh, that's it. That's yeah, that last it's clip. Irreversible that, damage. That one woman just has like Reagan's hair in her oh, mouth. Ugh. It's hanging out. All right, well. Jesus. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Have you seen Lemon Party? <laughs> <laughs> I like I like the fucking oh, puke in the mouth. I think it's funny that they close with um, the shit in uh, they know that's uh, Yeah, yeah. yeah. And they're like in an office where they're both receptionists yeah, and yeah, some and they got know. bored. They're probably yeah. on a break. Yeah, you gotta make yeah, it, it you gotta make it believable. There's Lemon Party. All right, this up scene. Yeah, that's that's Lemon Party. I see that. Oh, no. That's nice. Have I showed this to my that's wife good. once, and she said, uh, she saw this, and she said, you know what, that's kind of sweet. <laughs> she, said, she said it's the only pornography she's ever seen where there's no victims. What? Everybody's happy here. Oh, they're they're all winning, aren't well, they? We're Everybody's trying to, winning. Yeah. We're trying to figure out who is the gayest guy in that uh, shot. Oh, it's got to be the, the guy. guy. It's the guy who's not talking his mouth. It's yeah. also holding the guy. The guy. <laughs> it's not even the gayest guy. Here it is. Here it is. I think the guy paid have for to, it. You have to be one of these guys. Yeah. Which one is it? The guy uh, oh, sucking the cock. cameraman. <laughs> that's, usually the, that's the smart answer. But if you had to be one I of those three, I think the dude uh, <laughs> kissing the, the guy whose dick isn't involved and he just has his hand on the dude's chest. Uh, he's, he's yeah. he's what, is, what is he getting out of that? His red dog well, dick is poking to the side. And I mean, you be that than being getting, blown uh, by an old man uh, or blowing uh, an old man. I'd rather, I'd rather blow Jack Nicholas. Be, we call him. <laughs> 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 Jack Nicholas. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, like and he's blowing Ed Koch. John Witherspoon. Dick smells like. Yeah, John, uh, <laughs> doesn't like just, Thurston Howell the third. Thurston Howell. Yeah. Hey, uh, Matt Lafar writes. Uh, he, he wants to know if Louis would rather watch Two Girls One Cup or listen to Val yeah. Kilmer sing. <laughs> oh Jesus, bro! Well, that should be the soundtrack. <laughs> God, that's all. Daddy, who's so, your, hold your God. daddy, whatever. Blah, that's blah, just blah. that's just wrong, Fucking isn't it? In every what? Why? I've, I've seen much worse it. than that. You've seen Meat Spin, right? What? Meat Spin? Uh, no, I don't watch this kind of shit. I just don't. These and I don't have reason. a shit pro I mean, like, I have a two-year-old, and I change your diaper, and it's it's chaos in there. <laughs> it's chaos. It's just fucking mountains of shit, and yeah. I clean it out of her cunt, which I've talked about on the air here. So I don't mind, you know, vaginas and shit are nat natural, you know, occurrence, and out one hole in the other. But uh, I don't know why that's so upsetting to me. It's really just these... You broke, broke our, her you eye broke shadow. Our stuff, man. <laughs> <laughs> She had this cheap blue eyeshadow and yeah. this cunty look on her face. They, they tend to not overspend on makeup during the fucking <laughs> yeah. Brazilian shit films. <laughs> one of those jobs. You've never heard this on a Brazilian shit film set. So could you fix my lipstick? <laughs> cut, cut, cut. Oh, yeah, you never shit. hear cut. <laughs> exactly. Uh, Unless somebody says something kind. <laughs> can we do that? Yeah, can uh, we do that again? Yeah, tomorrow. Could you hold or, please? Could you or hold? Uh, can we wait? I have to pick up a Father's Day card. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I saw a really bad video one time. It was a Japanese guy on his back, and there was a toilet seat over him. But as he was like mummified, and he had like a fucking hose attaching oh, under the toilet seat, oh, taped shit. to his mouth, and a bunch of girls were just like liquid shitting into it, <laughs> and you could see it like. Ah, oh, 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 like where bird. is that? I don't know. Oh, it I gotta see that. Wonderful. Fuck. Hey, are we this allowed to show the horse uh, video? That yeah. you talk about every once in a while? Yeah. I've seen that. Yeah. That I've seen. What's yeah. this one now that we're going? This is fucking. This is me in a horse costume. Fucking <laughs> 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 a man. Were you the head or the ass? <laughs> <laughs> We have it. I don't know. I'm Find Mr. Out. Head. Right? I, I just Wait, what are you showing to everybody Get right there? My breath. What's this one? The guy from the wire. I don't know. Somebody just feedbacked it in. What is it? Uh, 
Look at the behind the guy talking. Oh, there's a so, casket. Is that guy? All right, dead guy there at a wake. To be. He puked into the casket. Yeah. Oh my God! He Come puked on, on a dead man. Here. Is that uh, real? Fake. He puked on a dead man. Fake. fake. Considering you can't see the actual guy vomiting, I'm a yeah. little skeptical. Yeah, that's and fake. No, All right, that was a waste. Fuck like Ebola in his world. How about fucking uh, get to fucking uh, what do I type? Mr. In? Hands. Google Mr. Hands. <laughs> Mr. Hands. <laughs> Mr. Hands. Mr. Hands. Where are we going? Huh? This is fucking <laughs> this. great. Mr. Hands. Yeah, it's a fucking hot video, man. <laughs> I'm still. Um, uh, just, <laughs> that is really disgusting. But like, like being, I, I equate it to being in warfare. Hold like on. we've seen it so many times that you yeah. guys are the replacements that have come in, yeah. and you're throwing up over the bodies, yeah. and we're yeah. just like, oh guys, yeah. Yeah. fucking get rid of the, get rid of this shit. You're I never you're not gonna need that in the field. I never <laughs> like this kind of shit. I don't, you know, like I remember before the internet and all that. Somebody tried to show me a tape of, you know, in Marilyn Chambers, and some guy's shoving a bowling pin up her pussy. <laughs> Like losing Not a bowling sexy. pill in her pussy, and I'm like, yeah. I don't want to see all this shit. Nah. It's just gross. Shit's bad. I think in a month you guys will be showing this video to everybody. I'll so. look at anything yeah. sexual. Yeah. Anything. Yeah. Even the shit video. I just don't <clears throat> like uh, real violence and yeah, that death stuff is sh a shit. Too. Like people yeah. watch the, the, the yeah, killings and beheads. Yeah. I can't watch that. Anything sexual, though? Put it on. Yeah. I'll watch was, it. That was the Don't one that care. affected me the most. The beheadings. Those are bad. Violate you. Like yeah. they're, they're, this is g gross and yuck. But I watched Eugene Armstrong's fucking head being cut off. Yeah, and it, it hits you on like a fucking bizarre level. It's worse. It's worse. The worst like, detail sleep. I remember from those is a guy was screaming, and then they it goes oh. through his throat, and the scream turns into just this yeah. wheeze. <laughs> oh. It's Eugene. Ah! I didn't know that because oh, it's not going oh, through. It's just, it's just air pushing He's out. He's trying to breathe. <laughs> yeah, like a pig. You sound like a, a pig. Oh yeah. God. Yeah. God! Why would you watch and then they hold, that? And then they hold it. They always hold the head up to the camera, and yeah. it's got this dumb look on its face. <laughs> yeah, it's just uh, he but, goes from ah to like like he just lost the. <laughs> 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 it looks like, like a moron. It looks like he's either beheaded or he's losing uh, a trivia show. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> the blade. <laughs> I don't have a body anymore, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that is fucking horrible. That's, That's what happened. I, I, I've seen like still like, pictures. Oh of my that. god, I'm in this other country and uh, my wife, my kids, and all this profound, and then just die. Yeah, like every. You know what it is? Yeah, your eyes don't face forward anymore. Yeah. They're kind of. And your do mouth. What they want to do. Yeah. Oh, that is horrible. At least you hope it's over quickly. What an awful yes. way to go. Because the thing is, they're sawing through the head with a oh. knife. Oh. I know. It's not like a guillotine where it's like no, over no. like that. Do you ever see the one that was done? There was two people they beheaded out in public, and the guy, the knife, the head won't come off, so he has to take the knife and like ch keeps chopping it through the neck, and the head. Yeah, won't you come must off. feel that your neck coming away, like coming loose. You of course must you feel do. Your head I was so struggling. Body. Oh, that's like Imagine. so bad. And your spine is still connected, so you, you that's, until that's, that's why cut. He was trying to yeah, have exactly. Yeah. Until, until that's cut, go. you're alive. Nah, yeah. you lose. Fucking once the no, once done, the yeah. fucking blood isn't going to your brain anymore. Yeah, you're but done. that's the thing is, if you're cutting from the back, which they they seem to usually do. Oh, oh, if no, you're cutting from, you're from the, the front, back. Oh, from the front. well, from the front, yeah. then you lose your first. You're choking on blood. Yeah, yeah. and then you start <laughs> getting really tired. Is <laughs> it really a little and sleepy? And you know, weirdly, you get bored in the middle. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, shit. that's worse than oh. shit eating yeah. video. Then you feel like worse. a little prankster. You want to do wacky <laughs> yeah. things. And then you wonder where your keys are. Then you get, <laughs> yeah, then you get forgetful. That's what happens. You lose short term. How memory. awful would it be if the last thing you have is I wonder who's gonna fuck my wife first? <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh I'm please. telling you, who knows what your like mind God goes. Yeah. Up oh, on sorry, you. was that a little too God. unpleasant for everybody? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey, you crossed the line. Oh, no, I, I was just thinking about it. That's, I didn't mean to go too far, guys. Uh, my whoa, sorry. And by the way, you don't, you're not married, the so you don't know. Video. <laughs> you <laughs> you can tell you're not married, because the last thought is, oh, my wife is a cunt. <laughs> Have we seen Pain Olympics yet? Uh... They, they keep I trying to push Pain Olympics on No, us. I don't want to see shit like that. I don't know if we've seen Pain Olympics. Uh, looks nice. I won't watch. I don't know if we've seen Why it. Why can't you watch I it? I don't know what it's about. I, I, don't, I don't like know. hurtful things. I don't like painful things. I don't like um, I, like people oh, in what, pain. You know yeah. what video we should... I like... Um, I like fucking Dude, videos. Know what video we should show these? <laughs> know what video we should show these the guys? guys? Out on the limb there. The, the guy. <laughs> yeah, really. The guy uh, uh, not, uh, smashing in his own fucking butt plug with his dick. That's oh. fun. That's just funny. That yeah, is that's just silly, is what that is. Yeah, go to eatabuttle.com. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs>
you to put it. Dot com. <laughs> yeah, I was too dummy. excited. I hey, you wanted to get that out. <laughs> yeah, You're almost excited. acting too. Go to eat it, put it. Dot com. Read you. Mr. Fabersham, go to eat it, put it. Dot com. Eat it, put it. Eat it, put it. Ah, uh, fucking We're, you are. What are you? What are you? What are you? <laughs> uh, go fuck yourself. Where oh. uh, time is it? Oh shit! Yeah, we're getting get out of here. Eleven Where's seconds. Where's Mr. Hands? It's uh. What are you our, fucking on a dial-up? Our forty k <laughs> connection. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Uh, Judo Ooh. Three fan seconds. just came that out. That look Than gave Jimmy Ooh. might earn him an email <laughs> with his strike beard. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> <Sure, it's> scary. <laughs> Thank All right. What are you the playoffs? So it's either going to be the video or a horrific virus. So let's hope it's both. Yeah. All right. This is a video. All right. Mm -hmm. Deep, right? Thrust. Oh, yeah. Deep thrust. Yeah, yeah. This, this doesn't bother me. Oh, this is the horse, sure. right? This stuff gets me. Going. I've seen the horse. Yeah, yeah, like this. I the love how, Watch how eager Animals. the horse is to push that big dick into this fella. Is Mr. Hands the horse? Yeah. No, Mr. Hands is the guy that died. Oh, oh God. Oh. Look now. There he goes. Look at this silly okay. rascal. Up what an go. awful up ass. All right. Oh. Wow. Get the fuck out of here. And this guy dies. Now, this guy's supposed to keep the horse's dick from going all the way in. What? Yeah, that's what his buddy's slippery. doing. Oh, God. He's wow. going like, don't worry, I got it. I got it. Don't worry, I got it. Look at the little clothespins on his balls. <clears throat> but now the horse says, you know, I mean business. Oh, He's got clothespins. Oh, 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 he buried oh, it. Look at his Stop asshole him. coming out with the dick. Like, coming Stop out. him. How could his legs have a good one? Oh, it shot a fucking hollow. The horse is like, I don't get to come in him. That horse has no dick control. So he has clothes. Was that Gavin on your couch? So he's he's got clothespins on his balls because without those like this wouldn't really feel yeah, wouldn't feel just, nothing. Otherwise you feel silly. Dude, otherwise it's just, just like what so a, what a horse what a is dope, thinking me. What a dope the other guy is thinking he can control the horse with one fucking <laughs> yeah. hand. It's a fucking horse yeah, holding that, the horse's dick back with one hand. Yeah, he's like not, he's definitely work. not. Oh, a I'm, I'm judging it. All right, that is, is, that is, that is, is, I, I, I ain't watching. Well, what's this? Paying Olympics. Oh, Olympics. Play. No. Hit play. Come on. Yeah, yeah, hit play. Bobby's talking about cheese. you guys. Hit play. Well, it's because I hadn't made a full screen, Jeff. All right, here's okay. Thank you, Thanikin. Just stand. All right, here's Paying Olympics. Olympics. Why does a guy have a, a cutting board, a knife, and his dick is out yeah, on the cutting board? He's making cheese and standing up. That's all I gotta say. This is what happens when you fuck a chick with a cut his cheese. There you go. What's he happening? He's out. He's just shaving a little bit. No big deal. What is he doing? What is he tapping his dick with a knife? This is not child's play. It's Paying Olympics. That's it. He's tying his balls. Up. Tie his balls up with and time. <laughs> it's a ro rodeo dick. Tie it up with a little. Look at that. Look at this rope. little fucking penis. Uh, this, no big deal, see? Oh, oh, wait a minute. Hey, 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 What's hey, he hey. Do? What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Stop. What's he gonna do? That's oh, fake. No, that's that's fake. 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 Fake, dude. Fake. Watch, watch fake. Oh, fake. Fake. <laughs> fake. It's all that's fake. fake. Now you can watch it. Jesus fake. Christ. It's fake. I've done that. Oh, it's so wait a minute. Fake. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's fake. Wait, that's fake. I'm not watching. That might not be fake. That's fake. That might not be fake, dude. Yeah, fake. Yeah, Shut fake. up. You can tell by the way he's sitting right oh, there. Fake. Uh, yeah, I'm done. Is that fake? I don't know if that one is. <laughs> 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 Jesus Christ. That's that looks goddamn like my, real. That looks like my grandmother's pussy. Ah, you dirty fuck. I, maybe that might be real. <laughs> Wait a minute. That <laughs> looks real. That might, oh, <laughs> okay. He cut his balls <laughs> off. <laughs> Look, that's real. His eyes. I'm done. Dude, that might that's be real. His balls came out. They're so cute. His fucking balls. Is that balls? fake or real? How can it be fake? Who did this? I don't know. Are you getting fucking DreamWorks? Fans, <laughs> <laughs> fans, dirty fingernails. Fuck my production. Piece. DreamWorks. <laughs> Why? CGI Why? magic. Oh, oh, the guy Lucas. had fucking grit in his fingernails. This is this is real. Could get an wow. infection. Oh, that's yes. Great. Well, you get back to Rachel Ray now. Yep. <laughs> they cook on the same thing on her show. <laughs> <laughs> I just, you know what? Uh, we got to get out of here. Yeah, there's yeah. nowhere else to go after that. <laughs> I got shit but to do. Home. Yeah, so don't forget, you can see uh, Patrice Levittown at Governor's, Bob Kelly tonight, tomorrow, Sunday, Caroline's, and uh, <sighs> January 18th, his Comedy Central special comes out, which you'll be in before then anyway. And uh, of course, Louis C.K. in Miami Wednesday, Wednesday night, Knoxville and Louisville this weekend. Knoxville and Louisville, and then you got Buffalo, Cleveland, Buffalo, Cleveland, and Detroit, Detroit. <clears throat> and over the uh, February, February 14th, 14th, 15th, 16th. And Thank I want to plug for myself. Just look up my MySpace. I got a bunch of gigs I'm doing. One's in Minnesota, which is almost sold out, and Cleveland uh, second show is almost sold out. So very cool. That's Good. all I got to say. Good to for fucks. you.
All right. You guys want to do line <laughs> Denver, not so good. Uh, there were so many. Albany could uh, be better. Hold on. I'm sorry. There were just so many lines of the day. I will right, we'll do line every, of the day. Every line. I'm not reading all that. Uh, <laughs> BodogFantasy.net <laughs> gives you the line of the day. A listener won four grand from them. And uh, they got a trip uh, to Vegas they're giving away right now if you go to BodogFantasy.net. There you go. Runner-up line of the day. But Torgasm was dumping really hard. Like, there was one point where <laughs> Torgasm would go down, and then a shitty, like, movie from, like, with whoever in it. Jan Michael uh, Vincent? Yeah, like a Jan Michael <laughs> Vincent movie, but it came on after. <laughs> oh, very nice. Nice That's, reference. Uh, it's charitable. Somebody doesn't like Jan Michael Vincent. <laughs> yeah. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Oh, what did Jan Michael Vincent do? Oh, Step on your toes one time? just move on. The show's almost over. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> <A> judgmental Muppet? <laughs> <laughs> I'm teasing him. It's not like he nominated him himself. Just somebody else back there did it. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, thanks. Another runner up line of the day. We're, yeah. ama we're amazing at that. <laughs> what do you mean, we're? we're I, I don't understand what? why you keep grouping yourself in, Spick. <laughs> <laughs> you're a red headed um, plumber. You, you're a farmer. Yeah, but see, that's the thing. Go that's pick how my great. Spinach. Stop with the weed. <laughs> <laughs> Go pick my spinach. <laughs> and Patrice was sick today, too. Uh, yes. Patrice is such a racist. He, he was a trooper. <laughs> uh, another runner up line of the day. Because yeah, he's a filthy mix. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't deserve anything. All right. Hey. Oh, go back to Mexico and get a computer. Go back to Mexico and invent a computer out of oh, beans, you fucking you smelly spick. <laughs> Jesus. Wow, the fucking Hispanics took quite yeah. a beat yes. today yeah, sure in your right. hands. Breaking my dad's heart today. <laughs> uh, yet again. The final runner-up line of the day. Care about any black people? Any black stories on there? That's, What's that? You know, some kid from Compton who lost his Air Force One. No, day. I don't any, care. Any black cry coat any stories? Black no, kid came no. In and stole all the cases. And <laughs> ran off <of> them. <laughs> That's what. <laughs> hey. Gavin, you good? Everyone good? I feel good. Man. Yeah, right. I'm enjoying my smoothie. All right, we're gonna do the laundry. It's like day. puking shit. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah. Ew. Uh, was a dead animal in the bathroom, by the way. From you? No, so an animal's dead in that bathroom. I, oh, I it smells smell. like a fucking zoo. No, there's a dead rat in the up up in the rafters. Oh, this little fella. <clears throat> Something's dead in there. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Mm. Just don't eat your egg salad in there. Just saying. <laughs> <laughs> trying to give advice. Everybody's looking at me. <laughs> Here's your line of the day. Here comes. Line of the day, line of the day, line of the day. You know, two tin cans and a string. It's, it's, it's yeah, strung no. between a black guy and a white guy. None's gonna help. You're just you gonna get trapped. So the black people gotta stop stealing, and gay people have to stop <laughs> hurting as, God. Gregorio, Louis C.K. Line of the day. <laughs> Very good. That's funny. And that's, damn good, Lou. and that's how we end it. Uh, mm. And have a great uh, weekend. In, yes. In Mohegan? Yes, I will. We Safe should. flight. Thank you, sir. We good should luck. have a few uh, good stories on Monday, huh? Mm hmm. All right. Hope I'll be in Monday because I'm going to see Diana Ross. Into the, into the field. <laughs> no. You will be here. Oh, yes. Sorry. I hate that. What happened? <laughs> I said I hope they don't Thurman Munson his plane into the. <laughs> yeah. No. Canton, oh, Ohio. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, at least. Not on the way back if I won. That's right. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it would yeah. really suck. Yeah. All right. We're out of here. Bye. Bye. So. It's Flea Man from Westchester. I love Jim Norton because of his brutal honesty, his hilarious commentary on society, and that he likes to kill, rape, and eat people and admits it. Do you have any fantasies about Jim? I'd like to be in between him and Rich Voss and have them flip a coin to decide who fucks me. Fucks me. Fucks me. Fucks me. Fucks me. Fucks me. Fucks me.